Ratch of and Clark time. Here we go. So, I love, I love, love, love the title screen. Or I guess the press start screen on this one, too. I really, I just love, I love these classic title screens. They're so chill. Just, like, hanging out before the adventure starts, working on a ship. It's, it's so nice. <laughs> oh, God, are we all going to start doing that bit again? Um, likely. I mean, people haven't even really stopped. It just kind of died down a little bit. Um, but the games do it for us at a certain point, which is why I feel like it it, it sort of died down in chat. Um, this is my favorite in the series. I hope you like it. I hope I like it, too. I'm sure I will. I, I'm sure I'm going to have a great time. I had a great time with Going Commando. Uh, so I and, you know, I so I also like I, I went back and I skimmed through some of my uh, some of my first Ration Clank, like 2002 streams. And it really does just have like such a flavor, such a vibe. I was looking at the levels and I was like, oh, yeah. I was like, this level. Oh, I love this game. <laughs> I was like, I was like this. I like, I really did have like just a just a wonderful, wonderful time with Ratchet and Clank One and uh, Going Commando. I feel like even just like the levels and stuff, like something that didn't grip me as much. So I'm hoping this game uh, really does kind of like uh, make up that difference and uh, do some do some cool new stuff. Um, a lot of Ratchet and Clank 2's levels were just kind of like facilities. Yeah, no, yeah, that's definitely that feels like it could be part of it. It was a it was a very different vibe. Ratch Ratchet and Clank One is a lot more like rustic, you know. It's a lot more like is everything's got a little bit more like it's it's got like Going Commando gets a little bit closer like that kind of like futuristic vibe I think, or at least like mechanical. Like a lot of things are more mechanical in Going Commando, and then. Um, you know, knowing where the games end up anyway, I feel like this one isn't going to really change all that much. I mean, like even looking at this menu, <laughs> like it's it's a it's a machinery place. So I'm not exactly expecting that to, you know, revert to uh, the first game's kind of overall aesthetic, uh, like art direction. But like, uh, I, 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 I just hope I have a good time. I'm excited. I'm going to I'm going to not I'm going to fuck around so much anymore. Let's go new game. Uh, I don't have a save file for this one. I didn't even I didn't even test this one at all. <laughs> My Plargian Snagglebeast devours your mutant swamp fly. Oh yeah, I bet you didn't see that one coming. D and D. Hey, oh, it's like chess. Uh, what are you doing? Check and make. What? Th 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 that's cheating. On the contrary. The rules clearly state that the Blargian Snaggle Beast has an allergic reaction to swamp flies that last two turns. Oh, damn. Ooh, it is on again. Mactar, uh Casino, 12.31 a.m. I love that. That's such a nice little... <laughs> oh, no, oh, this is... This is Secret Agent Clank. Do you lose as gracefully as you will? I would not know, Maximilian. I never lose. There is a first time for everything. Agent Frank. <laughs> oh, get him. Get him. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Look at this guy go. You missed. So this guy's little bow tie. Secret agent. So cute. I assume the game for this kind of like takes place in the movie universe bring the car around Jeeves, <laughs> and mind the ejector seat this time <laughs> oh man why, <laughs> why they got Stay ratchet play in the valet secret agent clank Jeez. that was terrific yeah great change <laughs> the channel uh, but the man said to stay tuned the man said we the continue same thing. our live coverage from Velden. Just hours ago, the planet was attacked without warning by a terrifying alien race known uh -oh. as the Tyranoids. Officials believe that an evil robotic supervillain known as Doctor Nefarious oh, is shit. the mastermind behind the Tyranoid attack. Oh, he's here. As you can see, <laughs> the Galactic Rangers okay. are up a valiant fight. Uh -huh. They are no match. This early. Tentacle-eyed terrors. Indeed, this backwater planet may be completely destroyed in a matter of hours. Darla Gratch, Channel 64 News. Damn, okay. It's a fucking, like, nemesis know. time. But Veldin is in a Solana galaxy. Oh, no. Not the gravimetric warp drive. 
the untested gravimetric warp drive? The one you built from bloggy and scrap metal? Coming? We are doomed. <laughs> you were saying? I stand corrected. <laughs> I just hope we're not too late. Oh damn! I I like the energy of all of all that. I, I'm I'm liking it. I'm already I'm already feeling real good about the story presentation here. That was that was a good set of cutscenes. That was really nice. Felden. Oh hey! Oh we're back here. Wow. Okay, uh, so first things first. Client 91802, and welcome back oh. to the Solana Galaxy. Wow! Oh, this that feels nice. Oh, we're gonna get to see Gadgetron again. Um, okay, so first things first. Let's uh, turn down the music volume a little bit. I, I thought I turned uh, subtitles on. I apologize. I, I turned that on in the menu. I don't know why it didn't. I don't know why it didn't stick. Um, turn effects down for just to say hashtag Gadgetron. Um. Does that stay on? Okay, we'll, uh, we'll we'll adjust any volume settings that need to be adjusted as we go. Wow, the the they have a rotation speed option. Do they have that in the other ones? I don't even know. Okay, let's go. All right. Um, let's get into. I'm I'm excited. What weapons? We don't have any weapons. R1. Interesting. I wonder what that's about. Okay. Uh, all that is still the same. Straight you controls are all the, the same. Camera controls in the options menu. Oh, believe me, I already did. Uh, un unbreakable. What the fuck is this guy? What the, what the hell is this guy? <laughs> um. <laughs> fuck you. Uh, X XP bar comes back. Our, our health is numbers now, which is interesting. How's, how's everything uh, sounded, by the way, y'all? Is, is it uh, too loud to quiet? Is it... Well balanced. Let me know. I will do any adjustments I need to do. Um. Uh, ooh, I like this kind of right zooms, left tracks, missions. Oh, this is a, this is a, it's interesting. Maybe just a tad loud. Okay, we'll adjust now. I I bumped it down a, a couple decibels. Um. Oh, and we got this right off the bat. Can we actually uh? Uh, I, I think it's gadgets. Yeah, yeah. I want to select the. I always go the with the, like the, with the like the jetpack kind of stuff. Um, I think it's special. Jeez, skins. Oh, 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 oh yeah, oh yeah. I think this may have been in Going Commando, and I just never like really did anything with it. Sumo ratchet, ninja ratchet. Oh, this is cool. You buy them with, um, I guess, golden bolts. Um, oh hell yeah! I'm oh I'm so excited. Gatron thruster pack is a replacement for your old hell pack. You use a glide and to boost jumps. Yep. Oh, believe me, I am These on the case. These must be the Galactic Rangers. Hey, look! It's a new sergeant. Huh? Oh, new weird. Sarge, you can have my gun. There's too many of them. We're all gonna die. I didn't realize the Galactic Rangers thing was a was a thing before the movie. <laughs> um. Shock blaster. Okay. Press circle to fire your shock blaster. Oh, it's like a shotgun. A shock gun. What bam? What bam? What bam? Okay. Pretty good so far. Oh, uh, we're still working with um, we're still working with gold like uh, little little bolts. So I'm wondering if the collectibles are still gonna be platinum bolts. That that should be interesting to see. Um, I'm sure we'll run across one relatively soon here. Uh, is the is the audio sounding better for for everybody? Let me know. Gladly adjust again. How much have I missed? We are literally in the tutorial level. We just started. No worries. You have not missed a lot. Uh, like my ship is like my ship is like right over there. <laughs> yeah, it's like right there. So we're just getting started here. Still a bit loudish. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling the same way. Let me actually change it in the game. Turn the music down. Um, I am liking this. I am liking this track. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> it's a Galactic Ranger. I'm sorry. Fuck. 
let me guess. That somebody is me. We got a volunteer. Here, Sarge, take this. We'll cover you from back there. Try using the nitro launcher against that vehicle. Is this a is this a goddamn sniper? <laughs> nah, it doesn't seem to be. Oh, oh, it's a, a bomb gun. Interesting. Okay. Oh, ah! Goodbye. <laughs> what wouldn't you be funny if I said beam up scuddy about that? Like it's from Star Trek Scoop. <laughs> Return of the bouncer? Not really, not really a bouncer. It's more, it's more like the mini nuke, I, I would guess. To select weapons, hold triangle, and select an icon with the left analog stick. Oh, way ahead of you. Yeah, so this is more mini nuke style. Okay. Hold L1 to precisely target your weapon. Oh, I really I'm doing this. Yeah. Oh god, these games feel so good to play. I'm just, I'm, every time I start a new one of these, I'm like, does it feel a little better? And I'm thinking like, no, this one feels, this one feels more like, uh, uh, going commando in terms of controls. But like, it just, I, I just think just the games are good and they're like good video games and they feel good to play. So. Uh, alright. Is there any, any bonuses? Any bonuses I could, uh, get out of this little situation? It feels like there's gotta be something, like... I do really miss, um... There was, like, a trick you could do in Ratchet and Clank 1, um, with the, with the thrusters, where you could, like, you could do, like, a boost jump, and then also still boost, uh, do, like, the forward boost in midair. They don't let you do the forward boost in midair anymore. It, j it just turns into a, a double jump. Um, which really helped a lot with like reaching secret areas, but you just you just can't do it in, in going commando or this game, it seems. You know, it was a bug or something. Oh yeah, no, I, I wouldn't be surprised if it was entirely unintentional, but it was fun. It was good to do. It helped a lot. Shit. Okay. I gotta um get to the launcher here. Uh please. Nice. Alright. Make quick work of that. Um I do, I do like the, uh, the, the nanotech health style visually, but I think with the way they were, with the way they were just, like, they, they, like, they were increasing your, your health up to, like, you could, you could get it up to, like, 80, I think, in Going Commando, and at that point, like, you might as well just make it numbers, so, like, uh, yeah, I, I totally get, uh, why they elected to streamline it into, into a number health system, because visually it's nice, but, like, also... When you start to get into, like, amounts that high, it's just like, okay, at this point, at <laughs> this point, it would, it would be functionally exactly the same to do numbers for each segment, and a lot cleaner, uh, visually. Your maximum nanotech level Speaking of, nice! Still got the same system for that going. That is nice. Yeah, yeah, it's one at a time, still. So it literally is exactly the same. They just replaced the visuals with numbers. Um, I think I'm missing here. I want to be Thoroth. Thoroth. This game was for kids. Nah, it's rated T for teen. It's actually true. It is. <laughs> the first three games are T for teen, and then they went to, uh, I think, E10+. Plus. Oh my god, I keep trying to kill the Galactic Green. I'm sorry. I'm, hey, listen. I'm, I just want to say, so many of these games have caused me to just, like, instantaneously see a robot in the battlefield, and just fucking wham! Like, I've been, I've been so thoroughly conditioned to blow up every robot in sight, except for Clank. So, I apologize for my behavior. This is something I'm gonna get over. 
video game devs are awful toilet sold men. Jesus Christ. Someone's got some feelings. <laughs> um. Yeah, no, Insomniac were like really into the whole like. Oh my god, that just reminded me. Um. Did y'all see those images going around of one of the, like, uh, one of the Spyro 3, I think, prototypes being released? Uh, I don't know if it was, like, fully released, like, playable, but it, there were, like, images posted. Like, someone was sharing footage of it. And, like, ev every character had, like, temp dialogue. Either that was just, you know, the, I, I the fucking did it again! I'm like, oh, a robot in my path. Bam, 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 fuck you! Um, What's the situation? The Noids have fallen back to a base in F Sector. We have orders to go in and take him out, F Sector. No way. Game over, man. We're all gonna end up as scrap metal. Get back in there, Trooper. We've got a planet to save. Sir, yes, sir. <laughs> oh no, ratchet military moments. Anyway, yeah, the, the prototype is, is funny. It had people telling Spyro to. To just piss off. There was one that was like, I'm gonna have to, like, there's gonna be something cool here that I'll have to code eventually, but for now, what are we gonna do or something like that? It was, it was fun. Whoa, okay. We're diving. We're diving and we're diving. Fuck, here we go. Snail Vape donated five dollars. Shakes my head penny. First, you save all those tourists. Now, you helping these galactic rangers. It's what I do. I'm, I'm taking this whole fucking system out from the inside. This is entirely intentional. I'm playing aloof because it takes away suspicion. Tell me these two do not look like exactly the same at a glance, though. Like, if you saw these two, I would I would just think that, like, they, they're just fucking... Like, I, I just gotta kill all of them. That's what this game has told me is the case. But that's what the games preceding it have told me is the case. They, like, they're all fucking, like, like a, like, a green robot is such a ratchet and clank enemy design, you know? Oh, I just realized you can- oh, that's really cool. I was like, why is there a, um, I was like, why is there another weapon icon underneath, like, the ammo thing? And it's because you actually, like, see the ammo you have on reserve, and you can, you can switch them by just pressing the triangle button once, which, oh my god, is such- that is such- a nice quality of life thing. I hated having to press it twice to switch. I never did it. <laughs> what are you doing, by the way? You good? You good? You good? Not good anymore. You're dead. <laughs> also interesting, uh, it says V1 on the weapon experience bar. Which leads me to believe that since they are specifying number like that, there might be more than two levels for the weapons? I hope so. I, I, I'm really into the multiple levels kind of thing, but I guess I guess we'll see. It, I mean, it could just be a, a V1, V2 thing. That That's just as likely a possibility. But it's just like, it's it's all these like... When they take the time to do these like minor changes like that, I'm like, are you implying something? I hope so. I'm gonna- I'm gonna try and level up this shotgun. It's- it's- it also is leveling pretty quickly. Which adds some, uh... Credence to my- to my theory. Oh, shit! Hello. You require a different approach. That's not, that's not working at all. I'm just gonna... What the fuck? Oh, oh, I was doing- oh, that's the shotgun! I don't know why I thought that was the... I thought it was just hitting the... There we go. Alright. I thought I had switched. Uh, wait. Is there anything I... Ooh. Anything I haven't explored? Yes, there's like a whole section over there. BRB! Ba -da -da -ba -da -da -ba -da -da 
I wasn't trying to sing Sea Shanty, but I got awfully close there, huh? I, I was seeing. Oh my god, that was not. I did not hit those notes well. That was, that was shameful. What am I trying to do here? I'm trying to trying to get up here. That's what I'm trying to do. Give me up. Let me up. Give me the give me the fun give me a fun bonus for doing this. Ratchet, we have to meet with the rest of the rangers. Shut up! Wait, no, that's that's a uh, that's Ratchet and Clank one Ratchet. Uh, you say? <laughs> okay, buddy, I'll get right on it. Why was I doing Sonic? I was just doing Sonic there. Whoa! All right. Hold down L2 or R2 while running. Oh, yeah. No, I'm aware. Sir, we have a transmission from the president. How are things on the front line, soldier? Is, is that secret agent Clank? Greetings, sir. We are here to help. Well, this is an honor. And I see you brought your chauffeur along. What? No, no. Hold on a second, This furry Clank, guy. We must stop Dr. Nefarious. As you may know, only one man has ever faced him and survived. I've just received a top secret report on that man's whereabouts. Here, take a look. On tonight's episode of Nature's Mysteries, we examine the Florana tree beast. Deep in the dense growth of Florana's Jambu forest lives a mysterious creature. Or maybe he doesn't. It's one of nature's mysteries. One of nature's mysteries. I've seen him run right through our camping site. He was buck naked, screaming <laughs> and holding a banana. Or, or maybe it weren't a banana. It, it could be. One of oh my god. Mysteries. Legend tells that this mysterious creature is actually one of the greatest <laughs> superheroes who ever lived. Oh my god. And by his recent past, he is now one of nature's, nature's mysteries. Mystery. <laughs> Tune in and find out the answers. What the fuck is going on with Quark? We need you to find this man. The fate of the galaxy may depend on it. Are you sure this is the guy you're looking for, Mr. President? Yeah, he seems like kind of a, you know, wacko. You may be right, but he's the best chance we've got. I know you boys won't let me down. You can count on us, sir. <laughs> Look at that chest, yeah. Uh, he's he's well built. This man is well built. One of nature's mysteries. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Yeah, this, I was literally just talking about, I was like, man, I hope there's less, like, industrial shit in this game. Although, this is very similar, this is kind of, like, similar to, Going Commando also started out with kind of, like, a swamp-esque level. That, you know, after the tutorial. That's interesting. Fun little, fun little parallels here. Uh, what we got? Got the N60 Storm, excellent all-purpose weapon for a variety of situations. 15,000. Devastating melee weapon with a long reach. Whip can be used to strike multiple enemies. Excuse me. Yes. Hello. To throw your whip, hold R1 and press circle. Holy shit. Yo. Oh, why has it got ammo though? <laughs> of course it has ammo. That fucking rules. What? That is so good. That is so good. Okay, we still gotta buy individual ammo. Oh, and we can, oh, you can store up to three recent ones. Oh, that's great. Oh, look at, look at the animation on this. Look at the idle animation on this. Damn, that's awesome. Whoa, this level. Oh, this level's big. All right, let's go. I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited. Fuck yes. I all I'm just gonna just gonna take a swim really quick. Just hope you don't mind. Your 
controller can be configured with multiple button maps, including a map that places <gasps> fire command on R1. To change to a different button map, press start, then enter. Yeah? Camera mode. How? Yahoo! Hartcher donated five dollars. Harp time. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that, that that doesn't sound at all like like what you type. Wait. Oh, camera mode first first person. What? Lock strafe mode. Look mode R two. I don't I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't think I understand. I you know I'm gonna, I'm not gonna menu and select controls. I'm not gonna fuck with it. Lock strafe mode is basically traditional shooter controls. Oh, I'll fuck with it a little bit. Let's try it. Let's try it. Why not? Lock strafe mode. Um, gonna do inverted for both of these still. Oh shit! Oh no no no! I didn't realize what I had until it was gone. What the fuck? The hell? Oh 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 shit! That sucks. That's so bad. <laughs> That's so bad. All right, let's go. This game allows you to play first person for some reason. That's pretty cool, though. I mean, it's interesting. But uh, we're gonna, we're gonna stick around. Oh, is this a bolt multiplier? The jackpot crate multiplies all bolts and experience gained for a limited time. Oh, for a limited time. Oh shit. Oh god. I gotta, I gotta take advantage of this. That's cool. Usually you can only do multiplier in challenge mode, but uh, here they say, hey, you shouldn't be too challenging to fucking get money. Oh, wait, I, uh, why am I using the, the whip? I'm wasting all that ammo. I only have four shots left. Uh, there we go. Thank you for the extra ammo. I was just talking about how- to Oh no, it's one of you- It's one of you bitches again. Ah! Okay, let me, uh... Thank you. It's- It's cool, but it, uh... It's, like, objectively the worst way to play. Do you mean the first-person thing? Um, I'm gonna- I'm gonna refill my ammo on the- On pretty much everything. I used that whip way too much just now. Um, okay. Let's, let's keep leveling up the shotgun for a little bit. FPS mode isn't too bad, but you can only comet strike with the wrench and whip. Yeah, no, that sucks. I like being able to, I like being able to throw it. Ratchet and Clank deserves to be in third person. Third person is where Ratchet and Clank has respect. I, I'm, for some reason I'm scared that I just said first person. If I did, I meant third person. <laughs> just covered my bases. Third person is the only way to see our backpack. Well, yeah, exactly. What second person? Second person is, uh, uh, so, so, the example, third person is she, first person is me, second person is you. Yeah, 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 Doomer Skeletor, you. You are the second person. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to adjust to myself for a second. Yeah, second person is, is like for, for choose your own adventure stories and stuff. Where am I, where am I even going? Oh, did I like, it's like another path entirely? 
Oh, hold on. I think I missed a progress area. Wait, so all D and D all D and D games are second person. Yeah, fair. Well, they're they're second person and first person. They're second person from the perspective of the DM, but they're uh, they're first person from the perspective of the player. Also, technically third person from the perspective of the DM when they're referring to NPCs. Wow, D and D has it all. by jumping onto it and pressing X until you reach the top. Wow, thanks so much. Ladders, they work. Hi up. Oh shit. That was a powerful final shot. Yeah, I love learning. Why does, um... Oh shit! I was, li oh my god, wait, this, they do have a fucking buy all the ammo option. I didn't even realize. I didn't even know this This was what that was. I thought it was just one of my, my weapons. I was like, what? I, I literally just had, I was about to ask like, why does this one never leave? Even though it doesn't let me. Oh shit, that's cool. It just, it just looks, it just looks like another weapon. Uh, in the, in the, in the thing that you can buy ammo for, but I was, I had to ask, like, why is it not leaving when I, when I buy everything? Because all the other ones disappear. Which I thought was also a pretty cool quality of life change. And I was wondering why... I was like, why, why is that one not? Is it broken? Is it glitched? Oh, wait, you have, you have my fucking, uh... You have my stars. You have my stars. Why do you have my stars? You're not supposed to have my stars. Oh, shit, I didn't reach you at all. Ah, uh, swept rules. What is that? Oh my god, they're they're doing another. They're pulling another. Oh, that's. Huh? Hello? What the fuck? Huh? I gotta go. What the shit? Is your fire time? Whoa! Holy moly! Oh, it's gone. <laughs> that is really short-lived. Oh, that's really cool, though. That's awesome. It's it's, it's weird, though. <laughs> yeah, it's like why? What? It's like a it's like a it's like their way of doing like a Mario power-up. They were like, well, it's still a platformer. We have to do some fun new platformer things. That everything we did in the first uh, or in the sequel. I think even in the sequel expanded on like the gunplay. <laughs> we need to expand on the platformer stuff too. Whoa! Oh, I had to. I had to go to the ledge. You can't wall jump into a ladder, it seems. Yeah, what would a platform game be without platforms? Um, I feel like since this is here, it's probably a secret thing. Right around here. Also, hey, babe. Hi, Marvel. How's you going? Hello, hello. Uh. Oh, that's a zip line area, actually, so the secret might be over here. There's no secret, just more boxes. That's pretty cool. Why is this? This looks a lot like Star Wars. <laughs> I just noticed all this shit is like exactly like the whatever the hell the wiki planet is called. Very Star Wars, this planet. Um, all right, uh, where are we headed? Oh, this will, this will circle us back around. Oh, and this is, this is where I thought there may have been an alternate path leading to, but. Kashyyyk, yeah, that's it. Oh man, I gotta finish the platinum for uh, Jedi Fallen Order. I think I, I got reasonably well off on the way there. Um, but I, I stopped at a certain point because I had to I had to uninstall the game from my PS5 because the, the internal storage on the PS5 is just, it's so, so small. Um, 
Which, speaking of, I posted about this on Twitter, but I'm, I'm, I'm extending the PSA over to here as well, uh, because um, it's, a it's something very, very helpful if, if you can, if you can utilize um, this functionality. Um, so you can, uh, so, so they recently updated to where you can move your, your, your PS5 games to an external SSD if you so desire. You can't play off of those uh, external drives because they, it has to utilize, PS, PS5 games have to use the internal uh, uh, storage Roger, architecture. I'll finish one, my thought in a second. Behind you. Where? Behind you. <laughs> Very funny. You having a good time? You trespass on sacred ground. <laughs> now you walk path of death. But, sir. Path oh, God. Oh, death. <laughs> Space. That's so good. All right. Well, I guess we're walking the pack of the pack the path of death. Um, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna condense this conversation. We're gonna go on. Essentially, um, if you if you have the chance, if you can get your hands on one, get um get yourself a fucking um external like SATA SSD and like a USB uh like a like a SATA to USB um converter so that you can use it as an external hard drive, uh, as an external SSD drive for your PS5. So you can put, not PS5 games, PS4 games. Because you can still play backwards compatible PS4 games off of external drives, so you're not using internal space. And uh, Digital Foundry did a uh, did like a test video recently where they showed off uh, the different kinds of like drive speeds you can get out of um, backwards compatibility. And using an external SSD if you if you if you get a reasonably good one is just as fast and sometimes even like a couple seconds faster the camera tap l1 e sometimes even a couple seconds faster than using the internal drive because because backwards compatible games don't fully utilize the PS5's like storage architecture which is really the main reason why PS5 games are so fast is because they can, they, they can, they, there's like a specific architecture, there's, there's like a specific way that they access the, the, the SSD architecture that makes them as fast as they are. But PS4 games don't do that. So you're gonna get like the same speed running off of an external SSD if you, if you get a pretty good one, um, than you will running it off of the internal drive. And, uh, I recently did this. I recently, you know, treated myself to an external SSD, and let me tell you. Oh my god, it is a fucking game changer. <laughs> Cause like, I have so much space left on my um, I have so much space left on my on my internal storage where I can actually put PS5 games. Uh, and I, I I'm just putting all of my PS4 games on on the uh, on the external because it's it's like just as fast as as keeping them on internally. So there you go. It yeah no, it's extremely worth it. It's um you know it's not. The SSDs are not super cheap, so it's it's one of those things where it's like if you can, I would recommend it. But Can not be. Okay, we walked your path of death. <laughs> now tell us what you know about Doctor Nefarious. Who? Huh? Doctor Nefarious. They say you're the only man to ever beat him. Who? Huh? <laughs> this guy's even dumber than Captain Quark. Yeah. Oh Captain shit! Captain <laughs> Holy shit! That's it, Quark. You've had this coming for a long time. Oh, fuck him up! Fuck him up! Yes! Oh my god! This is oh, this is so great. Okay, I'm y'all. I'm really into this. <laughs> it, it like this 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 sort of feels like they're kind of meeting their stride with the uh, with the story presentation here. I don't know. I just really like. Already, the um, I, I like like they're just they're like kind of they're like building a whole like mythos and, and a history here that I'm so into. Um, I'm really close to leveling up these two. I'm gonna kind of oh I don't need to even I I, I keep forget oh my god wait oh shit that was not so good. Uh, did it start me with? On my ammo? No, it did not. 
but I can max out ammo. Oh, that's such a good feature. How many, um, oh, shit. <laughs> well, I was gonna say how many bolts do I have? Let's see if I can buy the, um, other weapon, which I assume is just like the basic blaster equivalent. Um, I love going commando to death, but its story was definitely on the weaker side of the trilogy. Yeah, no, and, and that's that's sort of why its story and its overall like like pacing, I, I feel, was was really weak compared to even the first game, which I, I think felt a bit better because it had less complexity to work with, but this game already seems like it is it, it is learned its lesson in terms of like pacing a, a higher complexity. Of course, we're only like a couple levels in, so that's a little bit hard to say. For sure. Oh my god, I got one hit left. But who knows? Okay, uh, I gotta... Well... That's, that's no good. We just, we just entered, like, a phase two and I already got... One hit point left. Oh, if I could get that XP up, that'd be nice. No, we're, we're, we're so far away from a, a, a level up. There's no way we'd get it before this, this go of the fight is over. Although... I was gonna say I'm not, I'm not doing so bad, but I, I, I kind of didn't want to say that, because I feel like that would... Like it wouldn't be too long before I kind of fuck it up if I said that, but... I guess I already did, so it's inevitable now. <laughs> Shit! Oh my god! Fuck! Oh, I was really close there, actually. I survived a, a, a while with one hit point. How many bolts do we have? Do we have enough for the... Oh, we do. Should I go for it? Yeah, yeah, why not? Why not? We got it. I, I wanna, I wanna really... I wanna up my arsenal, <laughs> if you will, in, a, in the early game here as much as I can. So that we have kind of a, enough, enough tools to work with. Oh, this is a lot of damage on him. Holy shit! Yeah, this kind of this one kind of eats through him. Very nice. A lot of ammo too. Okay, we'll use the plasma whip for these guys. Very. Oh, oh shit! Oh, I. Oh no, I didn't suck up. Oh fuck! I forgot to. I was so busy buying the other thing. I. I didn't. I didn't fill. Okay, that's fine. All right, we got some. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, we're only three hits down. We are good. We're good. We're fine. Nice. For the oh wait, this doesn't contribute to the level up unless we kill him with a weapon, I think. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna stick to this. This doing is pretty good. Oh yeah, there he goes, grabbing his friends. Let me see if I can get some. Nope, that's nitro launcher. Oh oh, there's the bugs. There's the bugs. Hiya hiya. Ha ha. Okay. Give me. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I did not even notice I was so low there. All right. It's kind of a... Is this the first boss we've run into? I already... I. My brain is like, first boss maybe? I think this is. Pretty, pretty decent difficulty for a first boss. This is, this is nice. Um... Although I feel like a lot of that was just because I, I totally forgot to stock up, so I couldn't do this, make short work of those guys. <laughs> they were kind of on my ass for a lot longer than they should have been, ideally. Whoa! That thing, okay, now I know why I'm dying so quickly. I need to make sure no matter what, I do not get hit with that thing, because that thing does a shitload of damage. I just, I just noticed actually how much damage that does. Holy moly. Yeah, yeah, one more hit with that and I'm done. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Come on, hang in there, hang in there. We're good, nice, got it. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Quark has completely <laughs> lost his mind. Now what? Just keep the mask on. He thinks you are his new Dude, leader. me at right. everybody in 2020, right? <laughs> What the fuck? Are they killing him? Incoming call. This is Captain Sasha of the Starship Phoenix. The president has asked me to assist you. Is that the lady from Treasure Planet? I 
I see you have located Captain Quark. That's Kelly from Treasure yeah, Planet. Yeah, we got him, but, um, well, he <laughs> thinks he's a monkey. Of course. <laughs> Bring him to the Phoenix, and we'll see what we can do. Sasha, out. This is good. This is good. Yeah, yeah, Captain Amelia. Yeah, that's it. That's her name. I was, I was facing her name. I haven't seen that movie in so long. Look at that, Clank. This ship is amazing. Welcome aboard the Phoenix, gentlemen. Whoa. Impressive, isn't she? The Phoenix is the pride of the galactic fleet. She's equipped with the latest technology. Holodeck training suites, auto vendors for armor and weapons, virtual firing range, starfighter upgrade system. Oh. A Gadgetron VG9000 game system. Oh, God. VG9000. It's Mario time. Of course. With a Mavix Fireball Pro controller. Holy VR shit. Headset, Those things are like $80. How'd you get one? Will you marry me? <laughs> well, you've obviously had an exhausting trip. Uh, why don't you stop by your quarters? We prepared a custom living area for Quark, so we won't get. <laughs> they got a mad cat. Come meet me on the bridge when you're ready. Yo, you'll have the those controllers map. that got Press like the fans on. Or R3. So is this a? Oh, it's like a. It's like a. It's like a hub area. That's cool. Armor vendor, weapons vendor, VR deck. Oh shit! Oculus time. Play vid comic trophy room. Oh, this is so cool. What? What? I have a ship. Oh my god, and the ship upgrade is right here, too. Oh, you could change the color of the ship. What? Whoa. Oh, interesting. There's no, um, there's no like weapon upgrades here. Is that somewhere else, or did they remove ship combat? Oh, oh, that's this is so cool though. I mean, purple though, right? Yeah, that's I will. It's five hundred, but it'll make my ship purple. Yeah, thank you very much. Hello, Quark. Bitch. Okay. Um, I'm gonna do some exploring. Uh. Wonder. Okay, so I don't. I don't think we'll activate the next bit unless we actually go in that room that has like the question mark on it. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna hit up the. We already know it's kind of the. Well, I think we already. There might be something new here. This. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> oh, there is something new. Infect. Oh, two new things. Employee special discount. One time only. Gadgetron offers a special discount to all former Gadgetron employees. It's like this option to check your hard disk drive for previous Ratchet and Clank save data. Fuck yeah! Oh, I knew they. I was waiting for this. This is the the discount they promised in the first game. That's awesome. <laughs> yes. Come on, come on. Hell yeah! Wait, what? RC one. Save data found. You do not qualify to receive a discount. Only former Gatchatron employees are eligible. What? You unlocked a new skin. You can select different skins to ration this. But wait, so it found the save data, but it's not going to discount. <laughs> wait, that's confusing. You need to have gotten past the Caldeo world in RNC1. Huh? We weren't, in we weren't technically employed by Gadgetron. Did I? Did you start a new game plus in Ratchet 1? I did. Oh, fuck. Wait. Does challenge mode not count? Oh, no. That, fe that seems like an oversight. <laughs> that seems like a serious oversight. If you start a new game plus in the original, it works. That's... That's weird. That ha yeah, it has to be a, a bug or something. Pretty sure this was a PS3 thing. Oh, that fucking sucks. <laughs> I did also on Vita and it, it did. 
this is a port thing. It's not like this in the original. This is messed up. Oh, that fucking sucks. Man. Oh, you can test weapons now. That's pretty cool. Time to play RNC 1 now then. Well, I can't even check it again. It won't let me check it again. It, it only lets you check for it once. I did unlock a costume though. Man, that's that sucks. <laughs> it's only a 10% discount to be fair. Yeah, but still. Um, what's the old school ratchet? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Yes, I love I love classic ratchet. Uh classic ratchet look. There we go. Let's do it. Okay. You know what? That's that's fine. Small hiccup. Uh, it's really cool that that's there, but I mean, I guess if you if you want to play this, this onboard Gadgeton armor vendor. Keep that in mind. We'll notify you whenever a new suit of armor is available for purchase. Uh, if you do activate challenge mode, make sure you get past that level and you actually finish it before um, doing this. Huh? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fuck. Fuck. No. I had a, I had a sneeze and then it just disappeared. Ah. Oh no, oh that's gonna bother me. Alright. Um Save armor. Full body personal armor system reinforced with an energy absorbing ally called Reduce damage from entering fire by a full 33%. That's expensive. God, all this shit is so expensive. Oh, I did wanna actually I wanted to try those other weapons. I was drowning so much in my disappointment I forgot to try out the Infect your enemies with a brainwash that cause them to turn against each other. That's interesting. The infector fires nanovirus globules that infect enemies on contact. Whoa. Infected enemies will attack and infect other enemies until the infection wears off. That doesn't seem to be working as advertised. <laughs> Hello? There we go. Nope, okay. It just exploded again. <laughs> Enemies hit by the infector will continue. Oh, it's because they continue, continue taking damage. Off. Hitting an enemy with multiple infector shots will make the infection last longer. Yeah, a bit better on big guys. Yeah, I assume. All right, we're gonna let's get out of here. Um, oh, it just suck cannon. Oh, this is back. Welcome back, suck cannon. Good to see you, suck cannon. Let's hope you don't suck. Can you, um... Oh, you, st you still can't... You still can't suck in enemies if, if your thing is already... Thing is already full. Ah, oh, well. Alright, we get out of here. Nope. Okay, we gotta finish. The suck inning returns. <laughs> Wait, or can you? Oh. It's it's hard it's hard to tell. Congratulations, thanks. <laughs> suck cannon, pretty cool. Not the most exciting thing, but pretty cool. Um I I'm gonna of course stick with what I have. Not only because I, I probably would anyway, even if I could afford the rest of it, but I definitely cannot afford the rest of it either which way, so. Please take Cork to the cage in your quarters, and then meet me on the bridge. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. Uh, this is the VR deck that we just saw, which is pretty cool. Uh, the trophy room, which feels like it'll be... Or is this... This is my quarters. These are your quarters. Yeah. <laughs> I set up the VG9000 Thanks for the confirmation. Balaba. God, why is he like a human man? That really freaks me out. I don't like seeing think he got like more this? of his skin because I don't like well, thinking that he might be like a human man. Can be very stressful. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, 
You're telling me this nutcase is our only hope for stopping Nefarious? <laughs> We're hosed. I mean, he has three fingers, so I I would. Oh yeah. This is the VG. Yeah, you're right. You're right. System. If but you he's like too comic, human. You could play it here. Look at him. He's like a. Like, fingers aside, everything else about him, he's like a human guy. That is so fucking upsetting. <laughs> Need a vid comic to play. Oh, come on. Give me a vid comic. How do I get a vid comic? Hiya, hiya, hiya. Great. Meet me on the Great. You did so good. What's in here then? Trophy room. Welcome to the Phoenix Trophy Room. Whenever a crew member is awarded a Medal of Honor, it is displayed here. Cool. Uh, I guess these aren't. These probably aren't skill. These probably are trophies for like skill points. That might be story or mission related, I assume. But uh, all right, let's uh, let's check out let's check out the bridge. This way, right? Yeah. Oh. Very cool. Press triangle to interrupt these messages. <laughs> Thanks, Gadgetron lady. <laughs> Will do. We're losing the signal. Try boosting the power. Isn't that the president? They came out of nowhere. Tyrannoid invasion force. The presidential compound has been breached. We cannot hold out much longer here. Mr. President. Dad! Are you there? Oh. Dad? Robotic citizens of the Solana Galaxy. The hour of your liberation is at hand! Damn. Too long have we robots suffered under the bigotry, the stupidity, the squishiness and foul stench of organic life forms. Soon, all robots will bask in the liberty and equality of my benevolent, iron-fisted rule. And, as for you filthy organic life forms, you can look forward to being disintegrated! <laughs> That's all for now. Plot a course from Arcadia. Damn. Maximum speed. That's Repair the drop that's cool. I, I thought assault. he was gonna be a Ratchet going and Clank in. future we'll thing. We'll see you on Arcadia. Like exclusively. But nope, here he is. I, I didn't realize he was so early established. I was wondering. I was like, who's even the, who's even the antagonist of a, of this game? Okay. Well, now you know. Yeah. Well, that's. To view your current mission. That's the fun stuff. The that's 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 the, the fun thing screen. about finally getting to play these games. I, I I love finally being able to see just like the whole the whole scope of this series and like have all, have all the pieces fully put together because I've always had just like a such a small surface level understanding of of this of this series. All right, um, Marcadia. Florana, is that the tutorial mission? Oh shit, oh God, oh no. I uh, <laughs> press square for missions, right, I totally, whoops. I'm used to, I'm used to clicking it <laughs> and not having to fly there immediately. I'm used to clicking it and then it shows me the missions and then I can back out. Oh, this, this is the, oh yeah, this is like, this is, oh, this isn't the, no, this isn't the tutorial mission, this is, uh, the first level. Oh, oh, because there was, there was three levels on there because 
this is this counts as a level, but it's the hub zone that I was just in. That makes so much sense. Okay, our missions are fly to Mercadia, meet Sasha on the bridge, take Quark to his cage. Wait. Oh, oh, these are things we've done already. Okay, next thing, fly to Mercadia. Nice. All right. Let's go. Dr. Nefarious is a pretty strong villain. Yeah, well, I mean, he, he must be if he's lasted this long. Like, like this is the game he's introduced in, and I guess this must have, like, launched him into, like, his, like, arch nemesis status that he essentially Watch occupies now. The presidential compound is on the other side of the city. Keep your head down. The turnoids are crawling all over the place. Okay. Uh, spitting Hydra, electrocute multiple enemies with one shot, hold the fire button, select a group of targets, then release the button to unleash a storm of lightning. Pretty cool. So fucking expensive. Unbelievably expensive. <laughs> I have 800 bolts and they're asking me for 40 fucking thousand. I gotta, I gotta continue to level up here. Um, use the shock blaster for a little bit. Hello. No, stop. Stop killing the guys for me. Hey, you know, see I'm working towards something here. to cycle through the last three weapons you have equipped. Oh, I'm aware. Thank you so much for the tip, though. Nice! 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 Your weapon has upgraded. Weapons upgrade automatically when they're used frequently. Hold circle to charge up the shock blaster Ooh. for a more powerful attack. Oh, cool. Oh, and we're still getting experience. It's true. My assumption was correct about the leveling system. My pull instincts gonna do me well here. I thought this was going to be like a moving platform. The bolt multiplier does help make the funds necessary. Well, yeah, I mean, like, the bolt multiplier is, like, the single thing that makes, like, the rhino in, in like, challenge mode at all, like, uh, obtainable in the previous games. Unless you do the glitch in the first one like I did. What is, um... That, uh, can get there anyway, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep going around. But it's interesting how they have this little area here. Not sure what that's all about. Oh, anything down here? Nope. Just taking a swim. Whoa. Okay, well I've upgraded that, so I'm gonna I'm gonna switch to nitro launcher. Get that going. So so they do have multiple tiers of upgrades, which is pretty cool because we'll see like multiple forms of the weapons. I guess that kind of like 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 more than just two essentially like like. Hopefully that means it'll kind of like evolve in a, in a larger way over time. I, I, I don't like it when the camera does this. It's been it's been doing that a lot within the past like couple streams. Started in like the back half of going commando. <laughs> What is going on? Oh, hey, you are dropping. You're dropping, boys. You're, you're dropping boys, yeah. <laughs> Quite literally, that is what you are dropping. I got one more shot, unless this gives me more. Yeah, cool, two more shots. Hell yeah. 
I got maybe like two more good kills or so out of this one before it levels up. And then I'll switch to, I guess the plasma whip? Oh shit, inferno mode. I'm not gonna use that yet because I actually really wanna. Let me see if. Give me some nitro. Yeah, haha! -ha. Damn it. Okay, well, I'll, I'll work on some other stuff while we're here. Uh, that's what. It's time. <laughs> Fucking. This is so weird. This, this feature. Nice shooting, sir. Oh, and I didn't even use it. They're attacking the compound from the other side. We could sure use your help. You got it. Follow me to the dropship. Oh. Oh. oh, shit. What the hell? <laughs> no, okay. We're just gonna use this. We're just gonna... Two birds, one stone. I... I almost just, I was just trying to attack this guy again. Like, I was very intentionally pointed slightly in that direction, trying to get everyone in, in my arc. Oh my god, that really just hurt a lot. That whole situation was just very painful briefly. Like this cutscene because there's a good chance he didn't do any shooting there. Yeah, why'd they put, they have a, the guy say nice shooting and they put an inferno thing there, which heavily revolves around using the wrench more powerfully. That is pretty funny. Oh, I, uh, I'm gonna upgrade this now that I have the ammo back. Come on, it's gonna be like one more kill. One more kill on like a big guy, come on. There we go. What's V2? Just, oh, it's uh, it's electric. Boogie. Very nice. All right. This key storm is pretty close. Fun fact: the 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 inferno power up was made as a bet on the programs to make an an original box in the game so they can get shrinks. That's pretty interesting. I mean, but doesn't the um doesn't the multiplier kind of Accomplish that. There's like two new original box types in here. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Well. Okay. Well. Okay. Well. It seems like we have some. They really wanted those drinks. Yeah. Yeah, these, these guys absolutely tear through my health, just across the board. You do, you do not feel super strong starting off this game, which I mean is fine. It'll likely make the, 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 the power growth feel that much more satisfying. Holy shit! You are wearing no shirt. It's just a skin. Can canonically, I am wearing a shirt. I, 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 I'm I just so used to switching to the weapon wheel. I, I, it is so difficult to get me to use any, like, it's so difficult to actually get me to, for an extended period of time, utilize the quick swap in, in Ratchet games. I always go to the weapon wheel. It's like, it's just all right here. It pauses the game. So like, no harm, no foul. Yo, I'm... You know, these guys are very valuable XP for me, for my weapons. I really wish you wouldn't just annihilate them for me.
Oh, you can do kind of the drop attack. I think I discovered that earlier. I just didn't really take it into take it into stock too much. Oh, shit! Oh, and, oh no! Oh, this see, this is the problem. Now, okay, I think it. Oh, oh, it's gone. I was gonna say, I wish it would stop doing like the fire effect when it runs out of ammo, kind of communicate that I can't use it anymore. But then it did, so maybe it just took a second. Thank you. Ratchet's feet look like they have already stepped on glass repeatedly. Okay, fine. I, re I really want, like, like, Tuxedo Ratchet or something. Robo, Sumo, Ninja. I want Tuxedo Ratchet so badly. How much is that? Five special boys? Five special little boys? Penny bullied into putting clothes on him. It's like, I'm over here playing with my dolls however I want to play with them. And y'all come up to me on the fucking schoolyard saying, No! You gotta do it this way. And I said, okay, sure, whatever. I'm just having fun. You're having fun wrong. <laughs> These are all of the reasons why you're a fucking coward for leaving him without a shirt. I'm fine with no pants, but you need a shirt. Oh, so that, that's where you draw the line. Yeah, you know, it's well it's good to know that you have some convictions, I guess. Oh, 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 oh. No, that was my platforming assistance. Nah, it's all good. Didn't even actually fucking need it. <laughs> what is this little offshoot over here? That seems secrety. It's probably not, but it seems like it. Oh! Oh, it totally is! Wait. Look at that! Oh, it is Platinum Bolt still. My Pult Instincts, they're back! Any extra around here? Oh, it's a Tolt! Is it a Titanium Bolt? I, I can't actually see what it's called. Okay, Tolt Instincts. Why do you keep fucking changing it? <laughs> I, I, I prefer... The, I prefer them being gold bolts. I don't know. Gold bolts just feels like such a classic collectible kind of uh, material. And you got like like all like all collectathons are like find the golden fucking eyeglasses. And you'll progress through the levels. We do not have Inferno Mode anymore. Continue point, nice. We were- oh wait, we were right at a checkpoint last time too? Damn. Can we, um, can we actually see how many... Okay, we actually can't see how many gold bolts there are from the... From the, uh, map menu. Oh! More of these. Battle missions. Operation Iron Shield Part 1. Drive the 
tyranoids uh, out, or I guess tyranoids, out of the compound and then defend the area against a series of brutal attacks. Okay. Will do. Um, I'm not getting the suck cannon. I'm not spending all my money on the fucking suck cannon. You kidding me? <laughs> Static Sable donated $30. I missed quite a few of the Going Commando streams, but I'm so happy I made it for the first stream of this one. Up you are, Zilla Chef's Kiss MWA. <laughs> MWA. Hell yeah, Static Sable. Thank you so much. That is a very generous donation. I appreciate that a ton. Oh, they're on this side. We're all soldiers now. I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna break that health, I don't need it. What am I doing? Oh, I'm so close. So close to an upgrade. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give me that funny, juicy V2. Hiya! Very nice. Let's feel more powerful. Uh, okay. Plasma whip time. Just fucking spank him. Uh-oh. 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 I love maxing out all the guns these games. Yeah, yeah, me too. I, uh, I, I always try to... I always try to get as much as possible. I mean, y'all saw... Uh, my, my last game play. Oh, if I can survive until I get an EXP boost. Come on, come on, there we go. Holy moly. They, they really do just tear through. They tear through my health. Oh, no, wait, give me these. Fuck! <laughs> Sorry. Iron Shield, that's always Iron Shield Part 2. Eris. <laughs> I didn't see them until it was too late. No, I'm going... Priorities, I'm going there first now. That was so genuine. It was. I genuinely was uh, upset by. Oh, the noise space right now is way better. Bill underscore James donated twenty dollars. Thank you, Penny. I've got this stream on in the background, and it's making this project I'm working on bearable. Oh, I'm Can't glad. wait to see the rest of this series with you. Hell yeah! That is that's so nice of you to say. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm super happy that uh, my, my stream can be of good company to you. Good luck on whatever you're working on. I hope it goes well. Uh, do your best. Hiya, 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 fuck you. I'm gonna die, <laughs> I'm gonna die. I need, okay, okay. Leveling is for less stressful situations. Leveling is fun. If it's not fun, stop leveling. <laughs> I don't wanna die! I don't wanna die! Why are so many characters in this game southern? Thus far. <laughs> Can I? Okay, this is- I don't know if anybody else would even remotely agree Freeman with me. Freeman donated oh, five dollars. Probably will end up falling asleep soon. But thank you for a lovely Tuesday stream after a long stressful day and thank you for talking about Shark Boy and Lava Girl. <laughs> I appreciate that, thank you! Uh, good night if we end up falling asleep. It's all good. Sleeping during a stream is valid. I was gonna say, I don't know if anybody will agree with me here. But one part of the the background music here has a very similar melody to like the <laughs> the music that plays during the Toy Story 2 bloopers. <laughs> the one that goes da 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 Did I watch them all die? Alright, well, more bolts for me. If we lose the whole squad, it's all over. That's just, a, it's just another opportunity to hear the music sting I'm talking about. <laughs> <They're 
hatchet and let all your friends die. Amazing! Uh, great, great. I love not getting any hits. No hits. There it is. Do you fucking see, you hear it? <laughs> it's like the same instrument. And a very similar, like, descending melody. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Yeah, it's Woody's Roundup. Woody's Roundup. Come on, it's time to kill. And it's time for Sheriff Woody. He's a fucking cop. There's the rootin'est, tootin'est, a cab in the wild, wild west. My friend, fuck! I always reach this part, and then I guess I just choose, choose betrayal. Thanks, Sarge. You saved our cans. Is Buzz also a space cop? I mean, like, kinda. I feel like it gets a little, it gets a little less specific with Buzz. But I mean, like, Woody is a Wild West sheriff. <laughs> I don't know how much more I don't know how much more clear you can be. Iron Shield Part Three. Uh, get to the plasma turret and blast those Noi dropships out of the sky. Let me stock up first. Yeah, Buzz is like a soldier. I'm fucking doing it again. What the fuck? I can't not. I can't not instinctively want to fucking shoot all the robots in the video game. <laughs> they're they're flipping the script on me in a way that I just I, I'm not I'm not ready for. You ever think about, like... <laughs> they even... It's, it's, it's funny, like, even... In, like, the Woody's Roundup universe, he still looks very toy-ish. Even on, like, the merchant stuff, he still looks a lot like a toy. And it's because... Nobody wants to imagine Woody as just, like, a normal dude. I think... Because, because Woody... Woody is a toy, but he's a toy that just represents a fucking guy. <laughs> he's just... He's just a white sheriff with brown hair. Do you ever think about that? He's just a guy. Just a dude with an admittedly neat hat. <laughs> oh, that phrase, admittedly neat hat. Yeah, I mean, you know, Woody's hat. I, I, I know I've said some shit, but it's not, not a bad look. Not a bad look, that hat. Yeah, Jesse's hat is fucking cooler. So much cooler. Will you stop fucking bothering me? <laughs> nice shooting, Sarge. We can take it from here. And Jesse isn't like a cop, right? Or is she? I don't. I don't. Is she, is she like a? 
Is she like a sheriff too? I don't think she's just a cowgirl, right? Under the gun. Iron Shield Part 4. Provide covering fire for the repair crew until they can get the turret operational again. This is like a whole fucking like s story. <laughs> They're just sending me through a whole sequence of events. It's pretty cool. She's she's just his friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's not she's not a cop. She's just an apologist. <laughs> like I'm sorry, by the way. Penny must speak her truth. This is not my truth. This is the truth. I'm very confident in saying that. I'm- why am I trying to fucking do the whip still? Look, among all of this discourse and discussion, I'll 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 leave it with one one final thought that you can chew on. At least we have bullseye. Oh my god, little guys! <laughs> oh, I forgot. You're a cop. I don't want to play with you. <laughs> Andy. <laughs> like a based Andy. Iron Shield, part three. Use the bolt cranks to activate the automated turrets and see. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> I'm based Andy, he's fucking cracking me up. What am I do? I use the, I'm using them. <laughs> fucking using them. What do I do? Wait, did it, was it tell, I'm, I'm, I'm this is not. This is not good. He's not doing so good. Hello? How, how the hell do I, I... I I must have missed something. I totally... Oh! Oh! Oh, it starts here. Shit. Press square to attach the wrench to the bolt crank. Those turrets can only target aircraft. You'll need to handle the ground. Our troops yourself. I can't get stuck in my head now. Wow, this, these sequences are cool. There, this is a lot though. It's it's really cool though. I'm having a lot of fun. This is awesome. Sid grows up to be a proud and honest garbage collector. Yeah, Sid fucking. Sid gets a no. You know what? Sid is a dick to his sister. Never mind. I was gonna say Sid gets a better. Sid's like a shitty kid. He's not like. 
I feel like the perspective of like, like, yeah, like, oh, oh what the fuck? What the fuck is happening? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> The perspective of, like, oh, he's evil because he's, like, torturing toys is a little bit, like, how the fuck was he supposed to know they were alive until they actively traumatized him to, to, to let him know that? But, like, even then, it's not really a defense for his behavior because, yeah, he's still really shitty to his, to his sister. Like, like, violating her, her, like, her, her possessions and stuff. Like, he's taken, taken all her shit and, like, breaking all of it. I don't like that. Who says you can't find good help these days, right, Clank? Sasha's told me a lot about you. Don't get any ideas, kid. She is way out of your league. Oh, I have plenty of ideas. Most of them really smart. He has lost his memory, sir. Well, then you'll simply have to find it for him. We need our He's like 12, though? When I was 12 years old, I knew not to fucking understood. steal my sister's yes, shit and break Doctor all of it for my sick hands, kicks. Sir, I, I swear I know. That's no excuse. laser shield went down during the attack. Now, we are defenseless without it. I sent out a repairman to fix it, but, but he disappeared. I need you to get that shield system back online. Yes, sir. We're on it. He's not he's not morally reprehensible or anything. I'm not arguing that. I'm just saying he's a shitty kid. He needs to be a better kid. Like someone needs to tell him that what he's doing is not cool. That's all. That's all I'm saying. Uh defense facility go to laser defense facility. Hello. What? What the fuck is that? <laughs> uh, it's a gadget, I assume. The refractor. The refractor is a gadget that can be used for both combat and traversal challenges. When equipped, the refractor generates a reflective field around Ratchet. Field direct all laser beams, including enemy beam attack. Continuous beams can be generated. Okay. Pretty cool. What's our missions here? Repair the laser defense shield. Uh, the city's laser shield. Marcadia's defense. Let's use your refactor to repair. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. I got it. I got the gist of it. Give it. Uh, refactor. Oh, neat. Neato. Spaghetto. What am I... What am I neglecting leveling up? This is V2. This is V2. Everything's V2. Nice. <clears throat> so, um... Does it work on these? No? I'm gonna assume not. The refractor will let you redirect laser beams. Oh, it's like the, Just uh, it portal boxes. The path of the laser. Hold L1 and use the Whoa. left analog stick to aim the beam. Yo, cool! Cool! That's awesome. Haha, <laughs> fuck you! I'm here to break shit and cause problems. In all ways but physical, you are the box. In all ways except physical, I am a Lombax. Oh shit, that hurts. Okay, alright. Well, yeah, if it hurts them, what am I thinking? What sound does a Lombax make? He sometimes makes a sound when he jumps. He goes like, yeah! Yeah, hey, Tin Kid! Yeah. There it is, there it is. Oh, it's when, oh, it's when he's hitting. There, yeah. There it is. That's the sound. Yeah! No, not the whip sounds, the fucking, yeah! Blow it up. Blow it up. You didn't do what I asked. What the... Oh! Oh, I see. I think I see. I think I see. I think I understand. Yeah. There we go. Whoa! Interesting. 
fucking idiots! What? Little stupid pieces of shit! I wonder if Ratchet is compelled to jump the laser like many cats do, but is resisting it. Well, he's not a cat. So I, I, I'd say not. Also, given his experience, most lasers try to kill him up until this point. I don't know if- I don't know if he's particularly attracted to lasers too much, unless he's like the one behind the wheel. The laser wheel. a little tutorial teaching us that it breaks boxes if we didn't already know. <laughs> I said get off the edge. Oh, get off the edge. Oh. Okay, thank you very much for leaving. You've respected my personal space and I'll be sure to treat you with the respect that you just treated me with. As long Ah, you motherfucker. You lied to me. Haha, <laughs> cool. I like that animation. That's awesome. <clears throat> oh, fuck! Oh, they got physics! They got physics! That's cool. Wait. Ba, 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 ba. Wait, are you not... Come back. Oh, there's a laser up here. Ratchet, there should be a spider symbol somewhere in that room. You Holy shit, they knew they were gonna make Spider-Man even long before! With the laser. That's crazy! Insomniac predicts the future! Should be a spider symbol. Whoa. Oh, cool! Why, why, would, why would Ratchet chase the laser when the spider does the job for him? This is cool. It's a fun little puzzle. I like this. Blah! <laughs> Just like to check every so often we're missing like secret areas. Well, I guess it wouldn't show us secret areas. That's something we have to unlock. I guess, if they still have that in this game. Oh. No, I don't want- no, I actually- I want to stop. No, I actually want to stop. I actually want to stop. Well- Oh wait, no, this is actually fine, I think. Maybe? I guess we can still, like, redirect it from here. Oh, yeah, no, that was actually exactly what we needed to do. <laughs> Blah! Just like Halo with the Destiny poster? Oh, that's a thing? I didn't know that. That's cool. Hmm. Oh. Easy.
can never stop the spin. The spin stops you. Stops me from my plans. Oh. Hey! Al! Hey, look, it's Al. Hey, Got bud. Shields up yet? Silence! I am concentrating. What the? That's a Quark Vid comic. Excuse me. It is a historically accurate interactive graphic novel. How can you use the city's defense network to play a video game? Simple. I <laughs> bypassed the security server with a 626 hex matrix adapter Stitch! and reprogrammed the graphic Sorry, I heard. <clears throat> no, no. I mean, it. Uh, Clank, you speak, uh, nerd. It appears you have a feedback loop in the induction coils of your DB3 <laughs> signal processor. Impossible! I ran a recursive check thumb on the signal matrix. Hey, there is a feedback loop. I don't know what happened to you with a feedback loop. <laughs> May we borrow this vid comic? Treat it gently. It is a first edition. Perhaps this will help restore Quark's memory. Shield power restored. <laughs> Very nice. Booty is in the eye of the beholder? Okay. Sure. I mean, I'm, I'm down, you know? Just, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna complain about that. I just, I just didn't think we were going there. Uh, where the fuck is the- Oh, it's this way. I forgot, we didn't come here on our ship. Very nice. And now we're able to do all these again. Nice, very wonderful. Back to the ship, please. What the fuck is going on? Oh, it's oh, it's just the thing we're transporting in. Fair. Don't scare me like that. <laughs> I love our purple ship. Purple ship, purple ship. Gives me lots of real good feelings. Oh, we already have 40,000 bolts? Holy shit. Very nice. Um, I like how it raises up when we, uh... You raise me up so I do not crush ratchet. And... One out of three tolts. Oh, man. Zero out of seven? What the fuck? Zero out of two? Oh my god. <laughs> Why are these... <laughs> Why did the games make it so much harder to find these? Alright, let's go back to Starship. Oh, it actually shows us... The the, the next mission on the... on the th Cool. I, I, I literally just realized that. That's very helpful. the little upgrades. Yeah, well, I mean, like, the, the, the foundation of Ratchet & Clank 1 was already so strong. All of the extra quality of life stuff just, like, really, really brings these games together in a, in a big way. Where could, where could the fucking platform possibly be then? You know what? I bet they're not, like, actually, like, spatially hidden. Although... I might eat my words on that, but I don't assume they're spatially hidden. I, I, I feel like it's gotta be like just some. Starfighter systems at this console. I feel like it's gotta be just some like some 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 like unlockable stuff. Like maybe like the trophies and stuff is more how you kind of go about it. What's this? Um, I might consider getting some armor. How much was that? Ten thousand for the first armor bit. Yeah, that's not bad. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it. Uh, I was, I was really hurting by not uh, prioritizing armor in, in, in going commando. So I'm gonna, I'm not gonna. I mean, obviously weapons are where it's at in terms of like the actual gameplay fun, but uh, I do want to make sure I'm, I'm well, well protected as, as much as I can because, uh, yeah, I had some difficulties in the last bit of going commando. It was still super fun. It was just, uh, I, I. 
I have to retry so many levels. <laughs> so many times. Near the end, because they really up the difficulty curve. Alright, here we are. Are you good, human man? No, you're not good. You're bad. You're, you're a piece of shit, is what you are. You do got a monkey, though, so... It's more than I can say about me. <laughs> Watch and learn, Clank. This is how a real hero gets it done. Minigame, 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 minigame! Minigame! Minigame? These are the real-life adventures of Captain Quark, the greatest superhero the galaxy has ever known. Hey, this thing on? <clears throat> Meticulously reconstructed by our crack research team with the aid of eyewitness accounts, <laughs> bathroom gossip, wild speculation, and a magic eight ball. <laughs> In the early days of the fifth Solarian Jesus Equinox, Christ. the Solana Galaxy was terrorized by a notorious pirate known Solarian as Solarian Equinox? Isn't, is, aren't those the guys who make Final Fantasy? For fish and chips? Though still in the prime of his youth, Captain Quark was already a living legend. I was beating him up with a stick. However, no previous adventure could have prepared Quark for his encounter with the dread pirate Blackstar and his crew of... Oh, please tell me this is a typo. That's robotic pirate ghosts. <laughs> if reading wasn't your subject, eh, Professor? Right. Now we begin the interactive <laughs> portion of episode one. Booty is in the eye of the beholder. Interactive portion is a minigame. Oh, shit. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, fuck. He's just straight up the toony fucking platformer. What? Just picked up an officially licensed Quark token. Collect all the tokens in the level to earn a secret. Oh, ride. this is so cool. Oh my god. Ah, uh, fuck. I love God. The Ratchet and Clank games are so good. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just. Baby, the red ones are worth ten Quark tokens. They just they just go above and beyond so much in a way that like I just I I did not even realize, and I have just been having an absolute. Insane time discovering. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a quick little. Okay, really, there's nothing here. I want, I want to get, I want to get all the tokens. I want to get all the. This is, this is bad. They shouldn't have introduced a fucking collect them all kind of thing because I, I will, I'll do it. I'll fucking do it. Just you, just you wait. Huh. There we go. Oh, this is fun. This is so fun. Are you fighting like a pirate, guys? Oh my god. Yes. It like it like feels good to play too. Like they 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 did well on the on the control responsiveness. It's it is like not bad. Genuinely, like it feels good. <laughs> it's like a solid platformer. This makes me excited for, uh, for the actual, I guess, pirate-themed game in the series we're gonna run into. Uh, which hopefully we'll have time to do. That's, that's one of the more skippable ones on the, on the, on, like, the, the game's itinerary. Oh, we get a blaster, too? Yes. But, um, I'm, I'm really- Oh, and you aim with the- Holy shit. It's like Metroid. It's like Metroid. The fuck? Oh uh, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to see what Quest for Booty is like. Because um, I, I I mean, I like pirate stuff. Pirate aesthetic isn't like my favorite aesthetic, but I'm, I'm, I'm into it. It's cool. Especially like space pirates. Space pirates is like a really nice fucking like mix of a... Uh, of kind of aesthetics you wouldn't expect to mesh well, but mesh perfectly well. I mean, oh my god, if it has, like, the Treasure Planet vibe, I'm gonna be so into it. This is very Metroid-esque in terms of controls, once they bring the gun into it. That's very, that's very fun.
Oh, I'm really close. I think I might be able to get all these. 99. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. We got it. Hell yeah. Oh, free bolt. Oh. That's that's where the seven bolts in the in the starship hub come from. Question asked and question answered. Or sorry, yeah, tolts. Mm, a nice juicy health upgrade. Remember, cadets, there's one in every level. So 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 fun. <laughs> I, I like I don't know what to say except I'm just I'm just thoroughly enjoying myself. If 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 the game keeps up this quality, I can I could easily see this being my favorite in the in the original uh, lineup. Because like I I already like I'm getting I'm getting so much more of like a, a like a fulfilling like a whole sense of satisfaction from this game that that took a really long time to reach with uh with with going commando. Look at him, yeah. It's a good sound. Good sound. Holy shit, six thousand regular bolts too. That is ah, oh, so fun. I mean, I've worked on some real junk, but this one takes the cake. <laughs> Robots, oh, are you idiots! Hey, professor, snap to it. Mm. Once again, the citizens of the Solana Galaxy <laughs> owe their lives to the <laughs> dauntless so courage of the remarkable man behind the queue. With great reluctance, Quark accepted a meager fee for his services and promptly donated the entire sum to the Quark for Tots Scholarship Fund. A charity providing make A meager fee and it's like a fucking trillion. ...for needy people named Quark. I've got a big heart. Oh my god. Mr. President? Yes, I got the fruit basket. Thanks. It turns out I'm allergic to prunes. <laughs> Who knew? What? Blackwater City is under attack. Yes, sir. I'm on my way. The exciting, all true, right <clears throat> adventures of Captain Quark continue in episode two. God, he is such a jackass. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it phased into his face. There it is. Yeah. Remember how much of a fucking shit idiot you are. <laughs> Come on. Well, who's that handsome devil? There he is. It appears Quark has regained his memory. Hey, this dressing room isn't fit for a pig. What kind of shoddy production are you people running? That's him, all right. <laughs> he may need a while to adjust. In the meantime, I've got a mission that's perfect for you, too. We've just learned of a prototype holographic device that can disguise the user as a Tyranoid, even allowing him to speak Tyranese. Is it just me, or do you smell bananas? Anyway, <laughs> the device happens to be the grand prize on this week's Annihilation Nation. Check it out. Yay! More info by humor. Annihilation Nation, we feature an all-new Death Corps. Death course, death course. Meet tonight's victim. Oh no! I mean, contestant, Fred. Hey, it's Fred. Fred is a gadget on accountant who claims he once had a morpho ray go off in his pants. What a God. <laughs> Let's take a look at what he's up against. <laughs> Doesn't look too bad now, does it? Good luck, Fred. Hey, that was too good for not using a voice mod. What can I say? Another day, another death course. <laughs> he's fucking... He's like disillusioned to it. That's so good. Oh my god. Ah, oh, this is so fucking fun! Play Quark vid comic. This is, um... Multiple levels. Oh, okay. So we, we do have to find them and come back and play them. That's cool. Yeah, that's what I was expecting. It's a fun way to do it. Oh my god. 
also, it's probably better that way because otherwise I would sit here for the rest of the stream and just play all of it, like in one sitting. So they very much d d made that, they designed that to be penny proof. <laughs> um, oh, I wanted to check the, the thing. Okay, so we have 37,000 bolts. We get the Infector. I don't... Uh, the Infector isn't really my kind of thing. Like, it, I don't I don't really spring for these kind of weapons. Like, the... I mean, also, I was playing Control, and I, I, like, barely used the, um, like, the Mind Hack ability in Control. Quick scan the memory card again. I can't! It won't let me. It only lets you do it once. Also, it wouldn't... It wouldn't work. <laughs> it's just the same problem. And, uh, no other armor as well, I assume. Yeah, nothing. Okay. Oh, uh, well, let's get the hell out of here. I do, I do miss my, uh, my, my, like, quick, quick boots. The, the, the like, the, the rocket boots. Uh, that would be really helpful in this area. I hope we kind of get an equivalent, uh, later. Help the traversal here quite a lot, because this is a kind of big area for, like, it's a very big area, and it's impressive in scope, but, like, all the... All the actual uh, usable things are so small, and there's like so much space in between them. I I shouldn't buy more ship stuff, but like, kind of. Once it adds like the green, it kind of makes it look like the fucking like Larry Mobile, <laughs> Larry Boy, or the Larry Boy Larry Mobile, Larry Boy. We need you now. There's only way to say the day to say the town. You're from the cave. The tie squeal. And the rest you can look, you can burst in. Oh, never bought a yeah. Oh, God, it's gone. Who the fuck took. Hey! Did you see somebody. <laughs> hey! Did see somebody take my ship? Someone jacked my ship. Game's over. I, I can't go anywhere. My ship got stolen. We can get in. There it is. It's just the in it's the invisible jet. That's a Wonder Woman thing, right? Um, yeah, Annihilation Nation. I um, I, I want to get the tolts. Uh, no, I gotta do it off screen. I gotta do it off 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 stream. Damn. All right. Oh my God! It's invisible again. Whoa! <laughs> There you go! <laughs> Holy shit! I'm, I'm, I'm surprised and delighted that there was an actually... There's an actually visible ratchet sitting inside that animation. Imagine if that stayed on the loading screen. Imagine if it stayed for the rest of the game. Uh oh, everything good? Um, hello? Did that crash it? I don't know. I think that crashed it. It's it's frozen again. Hold on. Oh my god! Yeah, no, my PS3 is fucking locked again. <laughs> oh no! The in the invisible ship. Fuck this over. Okay, uh, I'll I'll fix it real quick. Oh my god, this ah, uh, this game is buggy. <sighs> All right, just gotta wait for the the hard reset. <laughs> no, Ratchet like died on their way to Annihilation Nation. <laughs> yeah, they were, I mean, they were promptly annihilated. I don't know what they were expecting. Um. All right. It's got to do the whole, uh. Oh, wait, no, it doesn't have to do the fucking rebuild the database thing. I can just back out of it. <laughs> nice. All right, we're getting right back in. We're getting right back in. 
right back in. Fuck, they died on their way to dying. Yeah, sad. It's a sad day. It's potentially unsafe, but who cares? Yeah, maybe. Maybe, but hey, all my save data is being uploaded to the cloud, so... The future is now. It's the power of the PlayStation 3. Okay, um... Hopefully that didn't set us back too far. It did autosave rather recently, if I remember correctly. Oh, where are we headed? Okay, back to the hub. Fitting. Oh my god, I thought I thought it froze again for a second. Oh, that was oh my god. I'm gonna be on edge. At any possible sign of it freezing. Um are we still on the same mission here? Yeah, alright. Okay, cool. Nothing lost. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, when was there a ship there? Yeah, I thought Ratchet just liked to fucking Numa out, out of the airlock. I like that little shot of like the them like flying into the galaxy. That's real nice looking. There we go. Yeah, I guess the Invisi ship really did kind of fuck us up. Are you ready to play? Yeah, I had to reset my whole right. PS3 to play. Let's meet our first contestant. He's an unemployed rocket mechanic who claims to have saved two galaxies, but most people know him <laughs> as Secret Agent Clang's bumbling chauffeur. <laughs> he hopes that disguising himself as a tyranoid will make him more attractive to the lady. Oh my god. That's mean. Ratchet will attempt to be the first contestant ever to survive the death force. I like how often Quark's voice actor is like just miscellaneous characters. <laughs> you can always like hear it a little bit. <laughs> All right, let's do it. It's like a platforming challenge. I assume it's platforming and combat challenge. Oh, okay. Push the button to yep. Push the button to what? Oh god, I didn't listen. Ooh, he's got sharp feet too. I wonder if he bites. Very nice. Oh, this is fun. This isn't Quark's V8, funny enough. Oh shit! The one time I actually acknowledged it, I was I was actually wrong about that instance. <laughs> Damn. So, sometimes when he when he uh lowers his inflection. It does sound like him, though. Oh, I just noticed! Oh, the upgrade is that it... it, it bounces, like it does the, uh... like the gold version in, in the original game. Of the, of like, the blast of shit. Oh, this is gonna be exciting. Shit. Oh my god. Damn. This is James Arnold Taylor? Whoa! That's interesting. I didn't. That, that 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 would not have been what I guessed. Uh, Agents of Doom. Fun. Oh, let's try that again. Oh man, this job is too much fun. Oh yeah, I can I can, I can hear that now. Yeah. He's got that thousand yards. To strafe, hold down L2 or R2 while running. Oh, I'm aware. Hey, be sure to catch me next week at the Borana Demolition Derby! This little guy can really move! I know it's a TV show, but do they gotta have those cameras up close? Yeah, you gotta. They want the they want the action up close. 
and personal even. I, I love the whole uh, flipping that the dynamic of like Ratchet being like the acknowledged hero and Clank is just like, who's this metal kid? And this one, they're just like, ah, look at this fucking dumb guy. But hey, Clank is there. We love seeing Clank. And I'm just like, yeah, me too, me too. It's, it's what he deserves at this point, you know? this to me. I will go right the hell back. Flee flawlessly? What's that? See, that's a skill point. What'd I get? What'd I get? What'd I get? Complete the gauntlet without taking a hit. Oh, shit! Look at me go! I didn't even realize that's what I was doing. I'm gonna, uh, switch to... Shock Blaster. <laughs> that, that same death sound effect is, is cracking me up. How about... I was actually trying not to get hit through the whole arena section now, but I assume there's maybe a skill point for that as well, but oh well. I, I didn't, but I mean, if you need me to, I can. Will that increase my paycheck? Infernal! Sorry, I didn't wait for your answer. I was just really excited about the possibility of it. Thank you. Oh, in oh, not infernal, inferno. Got it. Oh, I was trying to use my weapons. I forgot you can't use your weapon in inferno mode. I'm really close to leveling up the this one again. I'm gonna I'm gonna work towards that. Come on, come on, give it to me. This guy's gotta do it, right? Yeah, there we go. This weapon upgrade features a lock-on mod. Oh, cool. Also, sorry, I gotta uh, I gotta turn it down just a tad. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, I was wondering because it seems like the uh, the. The tolts are now mainly just for like unlocking the fun, the fun shit. These is they all they all cost tolts, right? Um, so I was thinking that that seems like their primary purpose now, except just being a, a collectible. Of course, I could be wrong. We'll see. Uh, but then I was wondering, like, are the are the platinum bolt upgrades from uh, from going commando? just being worked into uh, the, the, the 
the regular weapon upgrade cycle. Um, which seemed to be the case based on the bomb turning into like, like it kind of like had arcing electricity, which was an upgrade you could get with a platinum bolt. Hello. Hi, uh, Miss Courtney Gears. My name is Penny Parker, would you? Okay, all right. How about that, folks? He is better looking. Do not be alarmed, Sasha. That is Ratchet. <laughs> oh, I see you won the Terror Guys. It's very convincing. Anyway, there's something I think the two of you... We're just a funny little guy now. Work personal log, entry 101301. After I personally vanquished the protopet menace... God, shut the fuck up! <laughs> ...testing facility, I decided to focus my efforts on protecting the endangered creatures of the Florana jungle. But when news arrived that Dr. Nefarious had again risen to power, I knew where my true destiny lay. The training necessary to get back into tip-top shape has been exhausting. And my mind overflows with brilliant concepts. <laughs> Me. So I still yearn for the bittersweet stench of my simian companions. What the... <sighs> Acorns so much. Duties, the hero, the galaxy, He's so the annoying. He's such an irritating piece of shit. You're not gonna believe this, but the president put Quark in charge of the fight against Nefarious. God damn it! The commander just called his first team meeting. You better get back to the Phoenix right away. I agree. This does not sound good. Oh my god. Holy shit, I'm real. I'm. Uh, <laughs> do we have any more death course things we can do? Hell yeah! If they're able to fight two gladiators for a big cash prize. Heat Street. Oh, that sounds fun. Oh, oh, that was the one we did. Got it. Um, Floor traps, flame jets, and flying turrets. Oh my, that's a lot of bolt prize. Crispy Critter. Navigate a lethal obstacle course featuring fire traps, break away from floors, push blocks, and kill robots. Oh, this is another uh, platforming one. This is a boss. Um, I think I might. Well, first I'm gonna get my ammo back. I think I'm gonna do. Uh, I think I'm gonna do this one. This is right in the middle of like cash prize. Whoa. Okay. Uh. Oh, it's here, guys. Um. Nitro launcher time. Oh, shit. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. That's what you're doing? Fair. That's fair. Oh, this, uh... This thing is doing some good work on you, though. Oh, hey! That's a fun fact. I actually have a whip, too. You want to see it? You know what? <laughs> Maybe... Maybe since your weapon is, like, close range, I probably shouldn't make my weapon to fight you close range. Seems a little counterintuitive. I actually want to stay a little bit far away from you. There we go. Uh, this one. Oh, it's another, it's another tag out. Oh, shit, like the B2 brawler and the, uh, whatever the fuck. Another super boring, uninteresting, not important guy. Haha, <laughs> fuck you! I got more health out of it. Awesome, awesome. Oh, you're dead. You're fucking dead. Bye, bitch. That was easy peasy. Wasn't even wasn't even an issue. Beat Gary and Helen before time runs out for five thousand. I could do that. What was the one I just did? Was that Gary and Helen? I could fucking do that. I think I just did that. So yeah. This event is a time oh, I'm wasting ammo. Yes, these bitches. Oh. It's time for the bomb. Yeah, there we go. Oh, my bad. Thank you, thank you. Now I'm here. Okay. Let's 
switch him back to the to these because this this made short work of him pretty quickly. Oh oh they double up oh they double up oh they double up fuck. Okay. Oh wait or did that happen last time too? I genuinely can't remember if that happened last time or not. Oh I can lock on that's right. Hell yeah. Easy. <laughs> they got you for two minutes. Two minutes of crispy critter time. I'm gonna do crispy critter. Oh, I should have restocked. Ah, it's a, just a platforming shell. Ah! I didn't see anything. Push the button to flip the side. Hey, be sure to catch me next week at the Borana Demolition Derby. Oh, man. This job is too much fun. Okay. Oh. Oh, yeah. That's what is up here? Tolt? Tolt time? Ah, uh, tolt time. Come on. <laughs> Seems like that would be tolt time, right? It's like they restocked you automatically. Oh, cool. I didn't know they did that. Oh, look at, look at the way that fucking... It goes... That is so fun. That was close. Me, when I... <laughs> me, when I'm riding in my car, and I look at the rear view mirror, and I see another vehicle, and it looks relatively far away, but then I check outside of the window physically to see whether or not the distance actually adds up compared to what I am seeing in the in the in the mirror. That was close. Specifically closer than it appeared in the mirror. Note to self, never mess with a trigger happy long. Lom, <laughs> never mess with a trigger happy lum. Another obs another obstacle course. Uh, I was like, I want to keep doing these because I really want the money. But I also want to go and play that Quark video game. The last, the last Quark level gave me six thousand bolts when I got all of the bonuses. Ergo. Much more worth it than sitting here doing all come these. At least down. right away. Obviously, I'm gonna come back and do all of these on my own time. If not even on stream. But for now, I do wanna... Uh, spice it up a little bit. Paid to be a gamer. Yeah, I, I wish my PS5 gave me $6,000 when I beat a video game really good. We can watch combat or gaming. Yeah, and you're on twitch.tv. What do you th what do you think you want to see? Hello? Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and Helga. Welcome to the Rude. Q Force. Rude. You have been assembled here because each of you is an expert in your particular field. From Al's mastery of electronics, the skid's nerves of steel. Oh shit! It's just Helga's fucking all the powers of seduction. Each of you has shown that you are worthy to wear the cue. This is Years all the ago, old friends. I single-handedly defeated Doctor Nefarious, but like a rash on the galaxy's backside, he has flared up again. Our first mission will be to infiltrate the Doctor's top secret base on planet Aquatos. Impossible, you say? Perhaps for a lesser strategist. Behold, <laughs> my brilliant plan. See, those fizz widget instincts are, are coming back. First. Ratchet and Clank will descend to the sea floor and wade through a series of tunnels crowded with waist-high raw sewage. Jesus Christ! Please hold your questions until the end of the presentation. I hate this. After infiltrating the base, our agents will split up. Clank will enter the base's ventilation system where he will locate and deploy this banana-guided autonomous monkey device. Or 
Begammed. Begammed. Patrick will use his extensive knowledge of the Tyranoid language and customs to win the trust of the bloodthirsty alien gods. Finally, our agents will make their way to Nefarious's personal office, steal everything that is nailed down, Why ain't Joel Ratchet making a pog face? That's crazy! But it just might work. Ratchet Pog. This is so fun. I fucking love this game. I, I, I hate this. He's in charge, so. You win and I'll do it. It's a fun little character interaction they have in here. That's so awesome. This is so cool. Yo, skid dude. Sorry, I'm busy. Chinese fire drill. Let's go. Chop chop. Bogus. That's ah, oh, this is so fun. What the hell? I, you are a monkey wearing quartz outfit. Hi, sir. Are we there yet? Yes, sir. Okay, I gotta get out of here before they start talking again, because then I'll be compelled to listen. <laughs> Get that monkey! You wanna get out of here? Get that monkey! Ratchet, I urgently need to know how the Quark vs. Nefarious vidcomic series ends! When are you going to play your new comic? Literally right now. Find the Star Master scientific <laughs> calculator, please contact Lost and Found. You multitasking now? So wait, I'm lost. How to Quark regain a sense of identity again? I missed that part. We played a fun video game about him that we're actually about to play the second level of, and all of his memories came back because he saw how, how cool and heroic he is in the video game. Quark, comic episode two. Ariba Amoeba. A new evil was gathering in the shadowy swamps of Blackwater City. Oh, hey. A horrific breed I know of this place. Known as Amoeboids. Born in the laboratories of a oh, there's nefarious. scientist named Dr. Nefarious. Whoa! Think they called me insane, Lawrence. We'll see who's insane when my pets have exterminated all life on this miserable planet! Well, that should clear things right up, sir. When Captain Quark encountered the Amoeboids for the first time, he immediately executed emergency response plan number two. Hey, wait just a minute. Quark then proceeded to stall for time <laughs> while he coordinated the city's defenses from the women's restroom at Galaxy Burger. Give me that thing, <laughs> you lying, no good. <laughs> right. Now, where were we? The moment I touched down, God damn I knew it with the, the situation called for a head on assault. Without hesitation, I rushed to do I love his crayon drawings. This is so fun. <laughs> Oh yeah, we, we can't risk them telling the actual story. No way, no how. Okay. Anything? Oh. Oh, we get wall jumps. Intriguing. Oh yeah, that was a cork pot. I think? I just can't remember. For the fancy stuff. Press X while I'm in the air near a wall to see my awesome wall kid move. <laughs> yeah, me void origin story. This is awesome. I like to think Quark programmed these all by himself. Well, I was gonna say, it is- it is clearly coming from a team. I mean, like, they were about to start telling, like, a real-ass story. And he, like, specifically commandeered the microphone. <laughs> Told him to can it. Oh, whoa! Not what I expected. I don't know, I, I feel like this is a- this is a larger effort that he just has, like, a lot of influence on. Oh, 
There we go, there we go, there we go. We got it, we got it. Oh, that, that's an interesting little platforming puzzle. You hang on until it moves over, and then you can jump up. Fuck! <laughs> okay. Just making sure I got everything. Wait, would this assume Nefarious came on set and voiced himself? Oh my god. Hey, listen, you know, Nefarious might be... Nefarious. But... He does appreciate the arts. I wanna know... Aha! I am so glad I went back. So, okay, so I get, I get the sense that finding these collectibles is gonna be a little bit more challenging as we go along than it was in, in the tutorial level. <laughs> I hate, I hate, I hate this. I hate, I hate him. I don't like him. <laughs> Oh, I just realized how low we are in health. Jesus. Speaking of... <laughs> oh, we got a checkpoint here. That's helpful. Oh, oh, okay. Let me up here. Let me up here. Let me up here. Let me up here. Please. Can't get up there. Aha! Interesting. Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> Sorry, my, my, my commentary is a little slow right now. I'm just... I don't have much to say about what's going on on screen. I'm mainly... I'm just enjoying... I'm just enjoying the... the vibes here. Yeah, I got that platform in focus. Well, I'm also specifically really trying to keep an eye out for these collectibles. I sincerely... want to get all of these. Anything, like, way down here? <laughs> ah! It was worth a try? It was worth a try? Just vibing with Quark? It's not Quark I'm vibing with, it's his video game. I hate his fucking guts, but he... he, he makes a decent game. I got 90. Shit! Uh oh. <laughs> oh, that's still a lot of bolts, though. Oh, that's still a lot of bolts, though. Damn. That's okay. I can always come back and get them all. At a later time. The Boyd army defeated. Dr. Nefarious had no choice but to flee Blackwater City in disgrace. You've not seen the last of me. I will have my vengeance if it takes a thousand years! <laughs> Dr. Nefarious was right about one thing. 
he and Quark would meet again, and sooner than he realized. For a true hero like Captain Quark, will stop at nothing in the name of justice. I hope there wasn't any crunch time involved in the developing of this Captain Quark game. It's listen, it's a fantasy universe. We can we can imagine that in the Ratchet and Clank universe, crunch time just doesn't exist. We're allowed to imagine that until they say otherwise. Also, all things considered, it's a pretty simple game. So, you know. Um Where are we going? Infiltrate the underwater hideout in Aquatos. Alright. Let's go. Ratchet, I couldn't help but notice that you aren't wearing your regulation green Q Force tights. I suggest you get your butt back in uniform before I write you up for a dress code violation. Back in uniform, you say? Okay. Gladly. <laughs> Incoming call. Oh, no. Clank! Bubby! You're killing me! Excuse me? I'm trying to make a picture here, and Mr. Big Shot Star is nowhere to be found! I am currently occupied with a mission of galactic security. Right, right. I get it. You want a bigger Clank trailer? Clank looks so Done. bad. You want a daily oil massage? Done! I need my star on the set pronto, capiche? Uh, you're, uh, breaking up. You know, I can see you, weasel boy. <laughs> oh, yeah? How about now? Oh, shit. He'll figure something out. We've got work to do. Weasel boy, so rude. Yeah, they're so rude to Ratchet. What did he do to deserve this? I know he was really mean in the first game. Subtitles are on. I it, they just won't they weren't working in that cutscene for some reason, but they're on. At least they should be. They've been on the whole time. Or at least I, I made a point to turn them on at the beginning, so I don't know why I, I I like I haven't gone to the audio settings except to change the volume. I mean I could check really quick, but I'm pretty sure they're on. That may have just been a glitch. Uh, yeah, they're on. Skid, what are you doing here? My code name is Shadow Dude, bro. Black Ops are my especiality. I figured you guys could use my help. Uh, thanks, Shadow Dude, but I think we've got this one covered. All right, I'll just take my hacker <laughs> and go back to the ship. Hacker? Oh, well, you know, on second thought, <laughs> I'd like you to join the mission, Shadow Dude. Awesome! This is gonna be sick! Man, Ratchet, don't be a user. <laughs> oh, I can, I can swim in this pool. Alright. Uh, what do I want to use here? I'm already... Oh, I'm really close to upgrading this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> One kill away from upgrading this. What is, what is V3 gonna do? Whoa! It, like, sucks them in like a, like a black hole. That's awesome. Um, all right. Any new, any new fun things? Flux rifle provides deadly pin. <laughs> Boo! Get the fuck out of here. Uh. <laughs> suck cannon. We could get the suck cannon. I mean, since it's here, I want to see what the suck what the suck cannon is like upgraded. Actually, we'll use it for a bit. We can suck up boxes, that's awesome. <laughs> Flux rifle is legit ridiculous in damage. Well You know you know what else is ridiculous? My determination to not use any sort of rifle unless I specifically have to. Awesome. Sniper rifle, I mean. In a Ratchet and Clank game specifically. I just don't 
I just don't get it. I just don't get why they keep trying to sell me the idea of sniping and Ratchet and Clank. I know I went on like a million rants about this in the last streams, so I'll spare you the I'll spare you the longevity. But knowing that they stuck with the sniper rifle weapons, like up until even the most recent game. Like, there's a sniper rifle in the 2016 game, and it was my fucking least favorite weapon in the entire lineup. I was just like, why am I, why is this here? Oh God, oh God, I have a multiplayer, I gotta go. Hello everybody, my name is Multiplier. Oh wait, that was a that's a fucking that's a joke that Chase and I made in the Battle for Bikini Bottom series. What is this? Hello. <laughs> no! Ah! <laughs> okay. Oh, that's a suck cannon. I thought that was the bomb thing for a second. No, fuck you. Oh, you have the thing. You need to come over here. Why don't you give it to me, though? I like doing puzzles. Notoriously, I have never not enjoyed a single kind of puzzle in a Ratchet and Clank game. This is the truth. This is the truth everybody knows. I love every single puzzle in Ratchet and Clank. There's never been a single kind of unlock puzzle that has ever let me down or frustrated me or made me go on like a 10 minute rant about how shitty it is. Why is there a ladder? Oh, it's, it's, there's a ladder here in case I fall down. That's a very clear. And I wasted that multiplier. The puzzles are always on the ball. Hey, hold on. Hold on now. You can't just be that clever. You can't just be that wink wink I see what you're doing kind of clever. Why are you like this? Yeah, no, I'm, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna kill him. I'm hiding up here. Oh, hey, yes. Hey, come over here. This looks fun. Hello? What are you, hello? What, what's happening? What is it? Are you you're back? Hi. Nice. If only you had a long range weapon. I, uh, I do. Many of my weapons are long range. Do you mean if only I had a fucking really long range weapon with a useless amount of ammo that makes the game less fun to play? Oh yeah, then I'll just get a sniper rifle. In that case, if that's what you're looking for. No, it has like two more shots now. Whoa! Well, excuse me. Holy shit! Oh man, I you know I didn't. Wow, I it definitely needed only two more shots. Here we go. I sure guess I was wrong. I was fucking dumb. Now that it has two more shots, it's the best gun in the game. There is not a better gun in the game than the sniper rifle. Just kidding, it still fucking sucks. I don't give a shit about the shots. Oh yeah, swim here. You haven't forgotten how to swim, have you? I, uh, no, I haven't. Oh god, is this where they're gonna start doing this shit? <laughs> oh please. Have, have a little mercy on me, please. <laughs> I 
absolutely decimated. <laughs> That was a whole new level of petty and I'm living with. Here's the thing. I didn't do it to be petty. I, I made it to... I, I did it to make the sniper rifle discourse... Mon like, just, just a, a smidge more interesting than just going over the same talking points over again. You know? It's called entertainment. This is what we do in the entertainment business. You gotta change up the formula. What was I just talking about at the beginning of the stream Be careful down there. regarding the Sonic the show a huge biomass <laughs> moving towards you down the Oh god, more like bio-ass! Get away from me! Uh -huh. Oh fuck! Hello? Hello? I gotta, I gotta put that water bottle hello vine on my soundboard. There's so many times that I just start to launch into a reference of that. I got your back, dude. Yeah, you have my back, but the enemies are at my fucking front. Look at that. You see these shoes shit coming from my back? Of both of us. Oh wow. This is they're so far away. I don't have any <laughs> my weapons aren't long range enough. Tolt! Tolt! I knew it! I knew there was gonna be a fucking tolt in one of these yellow sections. Hello. Oh, do we have enough for a skin? I can't I can't. Let me let me let me let me let me let me. Let me. I have Tuxedo. I want the tuxedo. I want to be a fucking James Bond. Ratchet. What if, um... What, yeah, what other... So this is this is it. This is, like, all we can get. All these. They're pretty good. I might, like... Uh, but I really like the snowman, too. Actually, it's between snowman and tuxedo. Tuxedo is one farther. So once I get, once I get four... The allure of the snowman might actually cause me to, to jump to jump ship on the tuxedo and go for snowman. The snowman is really good. What oh what about cheats, by the way? What do they have here? Oh. Oh, you do skill points for these. Well, never doing a single cheat in my life, I guess. The way it just like accidentally hit a thing and just whipped around like that. All right. Hello. Okay. Oh shit. I went for the tux until I found a cheat code to get the OG Ratchet. Oh, is the OG, um, is OG Ratchet not in the skins menu in the original? It's only there if you played the first game. Oh, yeah, 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 that's right, that's right, because it, it, it activated after we read the save data. I forgot. Oh, why did I waste ammo on that shit? <laughs> Speaking of ammo. Okay. Wait, how many bolts do we have? 58,000. We could get a new one. We could get a new one of these. Oh, you know what? I might actually try to incorporate this, uh, this shit into, into the fray here, because, um, that, that section that we died at last attempt, it'd be really cool to be able to turn one of those guys. Yeah, one of these guys. Hey. 
Oh shit, I gotta like... Oh no! Oh, they are! They're on my side! Fuck yeah! Uh, and then... Oh, we're already... <laughs> oh shit! Get him! Get him! Uh, that's not worth it. Yeah, alright. Cool. That's good. That's useful. I like that. That's not. That's normally not my kind of thing, but in in a, in a case like this, I, I I see its I see its value. Enemy infighting is always fun. Yeah, I mean, it's fun. I, I just, it's one of those things that I don't often think to use. Um, but I, I mean, I already meant, made this comparison, but like, in control, just to reuse that example, I like, I hardly ever used the, uh, like, the mind control ability. Um, I don't know, it just, it, it was like, it, it's not the most, like, actively fun power, so you have to really, like, think about it strategically more than anything. But, in this case, it does do damage over time, which is really helpful, actually. So if, you know, if I think of it more as, like, an area of, not an area of effect, but a, a damage over time weapon, yeah. Hitting an enemy with yep, I am well aware. Oh god, are they... Please, <laughs> I really hope the tutorializing doesn't get notably worse from here, although it likely will. I don't know, I just... I've been, I've been having such a good time, you know, being able to kind of figure out shit. I, so, okay, it's like, I don't even mind that they tell me things. It's just when they start to... Like, repeating tutorials against, like, a player's, like, direct input and, like, asking to re to repeat them, like, I think is one of the worst things you can do. <laughs> like, like, absolutely, please, you know, tell me what to do and then give me access to the tutorials in, like, a menu or something if I want to have a refresher. Um, but, like, automatically repeating them to to the degree that like the series events ev eventually does in the in like the 2016 game specifically oh wow <laughs> standing here mentioning the 2016 game we're on game number three of our series playthrough and i keep saying i swear i'll stop eventually because i always expect to stop but then you know what i, I guess it's just the nature of like that's where everything we, that's we know that's where everything is headed kind of it's just like a looming cloud over the experience here that i i can't keep i can't stop referencing back to because it, it just puts i mean it helps put into perspective why i'm enjoying these classic games so much um but yeah i mean it's it's not too bad in this one i'm, I'm not like it's it is not the reboot it is not the reboot um in the slightest, like it's it not not even fucking close, not even a quarter of the way there. But um, it's just something I worry about moving through these games, especially getting into like the PS3 era. Um, I kind of I kind of fear that like that might at least begin the trend, kinda. Yeah, holy moly, next game we in the PS3 era. Yeah, I'm really excited. I, uh, this, this is, is, uh, estimated, I've, I've mentioned this a couple times, but this is estimated to be the shortest game in the, uh, original trilogy compared to, uh, or according to howlongtobeat.com, which is just, like, kind of a, a comparison of people's general playtime estimates. So, um, I'm hoping to get through this one pretty quickly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna really, uh, shoot for, uh, four-hour streams for this. Hopefully get it done in, like, three or four, like, like I did the first game. Shit.
yeah, we're already at four hours, by the way. So this might actually be my last planet tonight uh, before calling it, because it is also almost 12 a.m. where I'm at. This game had a pretty short development time. Yeah, every um, every game in the original like trilogy, like one, two, and three, all had a year's worth of. Well, actually between themselves I don't I don't actually know the exact length of development time on one uh, but in like from one to two and two to three it's all a year in between it's it's absolutely wild um, so yeah it is truly truly shocking how good these games are given that given that fact um I was I Where's the, where the fuck is the... Oh, there it is. I'm trying to remember what the icon looks It's very similar to the bomb icon. Oh, you got nothing to fight. Okay. Cool. Even now, Insomniac makes a lot of games. Yeah, Insomniac is is insane. <laughs> just with their the rate of quality and also just the the amount of games they turn around. Um, thankfully, I I don't. I mean, I don't. At least not in recent times. I haven't heard any like stories about like a pervasive uh tolt 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 i haven't heard stories about like a pervasive crunch culture at insomniac i don't know if it's just because nothing's gotten out or if it's you know if it's just because they have a, a nice sense of management but um i i'd hope it's the latter i'd really hope it's the latter and if it's the former i'd hope that it, it gets out eventually that it's something they need to work on because Crunch Culture, I, I watched a video on Crunch Culture um, last night, actually, uh, and it was it was really good. Uh, and, like, you know, it's obviously so inherently bad for the industry and for people working in the industry. I mean, specifically for, for workers in the industry. Um, yeah, so... But that being said, um, to kind of circle this back around, I I, re I really like Insomniac. I think Insomniac is, is a great studio, providing they are not actively sacrificing the health of their workers to be as like consistent as good as as good as they are. But like, I don't know. I mean, I, I feel like part of me feels like the games would not be as good as they are if if it was a you know bad place to work and wasn't taking into account like work life balance and everything. Okay, something could always come out, you know. But um, at the moment, they seem pretty chill. They seem pretty cool. Crunch is apparently bad on this game, but it sounded more self-imposed by the devs than it being forced on them. Well, that's the thing you have to be careful about because with crunch culture, very, very rarely, and this is why it's it's crunch culture and it's not like specifically like uh, crunch management or whatever. Um, a lot of times it does, you know, technically kind of come from a place of, of passion or, or well, no, what, what I wanted to say was a lot of the times it is technically not, like, contract mandated or technically not forced onto employees, but there is a culture surrounding it and there is a, there is a, a, a sort of pressure both from higher ups and just from the nature of, like, wanting to keep your job and wanting to, uh, you know, like, th there is always a risk that, you know, even though someone is not technically forced to crunch on a project, if they're like a contract worker and they don't, there, there is a, there's a chance that a higher up, like an executive could see that as a lack of commitment or a lack of passion and use that as an excuse to end their contract or, you know, in an employee's case, fire them. Um, so a lot of times, no, crunch is not forced, technically. But practically, it is it is so hard to get over the hurdle of like of 
uh, management pressure or like uh, sort of like a a pressure within like the group because there uh, people have talked about how there's this idea that like if you take time off during like a period of crunch then you know in a way you are sort of putting extra work onto other people and nobody wants to be the person who elected to put work on other people and it's just like it's one of those horrible kind of cyclical things that is um really hard to address if you do not get down to just like the root of the problem and like really just overhaul the way that crunch is talked about and thought about and um you know thought about by like executives specifically clank did you hear that cuts we time. are not alone hey uh dudes i uh, forgot to feed my goldfish i'll see you back at the <laughs> Skid, no! God damn it. Well, if it ain't two of my best customers. Hey! Slim Cognito? What are you doing down here? I had a small run in with the cops concerning <laughs> a suck cannon upgrade that was mistakenly sold to a miner. Oh no! Where the kid looked 18. Oh, I Slim, no! It was a conspicuous place to do business. I take it you two are still in the market. Well, let's see what you've got. Oh, interesting. Mini turret glove deploys automatic. Oh, are these? Oh, are these from the previous game? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mini turret glove and lava goat. God damn it! I hate seeing this. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh wait. Oh, oh shit. Give, give it, give it to me for free. Give it to me for free. I didn't activate challenge mode on um. Yes. Hell yeah. I didn't activate challenge mode on, on Ratchet 2, so it, it actually worked this time. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. It was better for me to not utilize a really cool <laughs> replay mechanic functionality in one of the games because this port did a weird job with Try the save file reading. Your quick select in the pause menu. To oh, access your absolutely. secondary quick select ring. Oh, yeah, secondary ring now. That's very helpful. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. The lava gun's back. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, I missed you, buddy. I didn't appreciate you enough. I didn't appreciate you enough at all. Oh, I missed you so much. Take submarine to Nefarious's base. Uh, okay. All right. Let's go. There's the ventilation shaft. We must split up here. Yeah. Well, I guess it's time to put on the Tira guys and go meet my new pals. Good luck. I will assist you if I can. <laughs> Perhaps you should have read the instruction manual. Nah, no one reads that shit. It was nice knowing you, Ratchet. <laughs> Clank, no! <laughs> oh! Oh, we're playing Clank now. I thought we were going. I thought we were going. Uh, tour guys mode. Wow! Clank time. Clank time. I just got killed. Cause I got like, oh, it's like a stealth section. I get it. Oh, we're actually doing secret agent Clank stuff. God. Yeah, Clank. That's right. Coming to your own as an action hero. You deserve it. Let's just solve it. Oh. Oh, it's time. It's interesting. Oh, please be something fucking. He gets a gun? No monkeying oh. around. Hmm. Monkeying. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <clears throat> we are on an important mission. Blank, that little sucker will chase bananas any place you yes. him. Give it a try. Oh, it's a banana launcher. Got it. Oh wait, no, I gotta do the... Oh, 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 uh, button. Yay! Thank you, Mr. Monkey. <laughs> the fucking the Clank sections are controlling a monkey around? Clank, if the guards discover you, just shoot a banana and have the that monkey distract them. That is so good. <laughs> Fuck you, monkey! 
I love our sacrificial hmm. monkey friend. Ratchet, I need you to extend the bridge at junction G5. Oh, okay, we're gonna be swapping in between. Yo, here we go. This little bounces. Come on, give me a tolt. Give me a tolt for being explorative and going back. Damn it. Oh, and then we. <laughs> we wave, yeah. Ratchet, I found some. Hello? For the guys. Let's see. When you speak to a tyranoid, you should see a Oh, God, it's like display. Spore. Just tap or hold the correct button as it moves across your display. Watch what you say, though. These guys have really nasty tempers. It's like Spore. Oh, it's a rhythm game. <laughs> Excuse me, good sir. Would you kindly open that door for me? <laughs> it's an honor and a privilege, my dear <laughs> brother. <laughs> Oh, that's so cute! That's delightful. I kind of want to mess it up on purpose. I kind of want to fuck it up on purpose and see, like, what kind of shitty thing I'll say to him. Orange Crouton Zoom Zoom Butterscotch. <laughs> Go like a purple Fuck his toad face! <laughs> Your mother was a nine toed snaggle beast. You smell like a dead of me with its backside! Jesus. Alright, I'm doing it for real. I don't want to spoil all of them in one go. Wait, what? Oh, it's a whole. Your sister is a squishy lover. Ratchet. I found some online no, I no, I know, I know. Oh god, oh no, they're doing it. They're really doing it. I guess. Well, I, I guess I did fuck it up a lot of times. I have to deliver a message from Doctor Nefarious. You look suspicious. Who are you? I am Secret Jeff. Bridges, but I, I am a loyal servant of Dr. Nefarious, certainly not a Lombax. Very well, one can't be too careful. That's true, man, that's true. Hello. Don't tell anyone, but I hit five bolts under this girder. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> sucker, it's all mine now. Ah, oh, fuck you, man. Fuck you. I told you that in confidence, bitch. Oh, this is really fun. This is cool. You good? That uh, monkey is not, not doing so hot. <laughs> you good, monkey? God. Can the monkey get through? Oh, 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 I see, I see. It's another timed one. Oh, wait. It's probably not gonna... Yeah, we gotta shoot a banana in there. Alright. Monkey, go fast. Monkey, go quick. Monkey, jump over the... Uh, oh, God. Oh, shit. Uh, let me... No, please. Fuck. Just go really far. Go really fucking far. I can't... It can't go super far. What? Huh. Um. Right. Get in there, 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 you stupid fucking monkey! I'm gonna. <laughs> hmm. Oh, wait. What if I- oh, shit, uh, duh. Fucking duh. You get on the button. There we go. I'm up 
Oh, hey, it's the gadget boss. Nice. How's it going, little dudes? Glad to see you came back. This is, uh... This is Gerald. Does he actually have a name? I, I, I missed if he actually has a name or not. Hey, uh, how are we gonna... How are we you don't have a chance against that oh thing. yeah I just fucking got the gadget what am I doing there come back we lost one yeah there we go um all right monkey go monkey go here monkey go there God, this monkey's fucking everything up. <laughs> you almost got me killed, monkey! You almost got me killed, monkey! You're fucking irresponsible! Get out of my sons. You're making me look like a fool, monkey. I trusted you. Is a bot port. Select. Yep, I am aware. See, the problem is that I would, I would gladly, if you can still, can you still turn the tutorials off in this one? Actually, I don't know if you can. Oh, it needs two. <laughs> hey, get off the button. I was gonna say, if, if he can turn tutorials off in this one, I would gladly do that, but like, um, like, I don't want to miss tutorials for the things that I don't know about. Get in there. Because, like, I'm still learning new mechanics. Yeah, it's a double-edged sword on your first playthrough. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna do it. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna do it. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm doing the fucking this guy again. Can I, I, it seems like I cannot see anybody with which to talk to. Any of these guys to come over here? Oh shit! Oh god! Oh fuck! <laughs> Whoops! die again because I keep accidentally pressing square when trying to interact with the world and figure out how to get over this part. Oh, it's just timed, I think? Oh yeah, it's just timed. I when I saw the sparkles I, I thought it was I thought it was already on there. Hey, what's up? You smell like a dead enemy when he's backside, bitch. Ha, huh, bitch. It is a little weird they're doing like a kind of a rhythm game without really any rhythm to respond to. I'm here to repair the hollow vid in the break room. It's about time we missed yesterday's Secret Asian Clank episode. And that guy ratchet's stupid, yeah?
<laughs> your rabbit's face goes to devour your liver. Dude, come on. I was- I- I'm kind of glad they didn't- oh, I keep fucking- I'm kind of glad they didn't do it this way, but I was expecting that if you said something- Because they were like- they were like, oh, they react poorly to people being rude. Like, I thought if you- if you fucked up, they were gonna attack. I'm glad they didn't do it that way, I understand why. Would you mind extending the bridge, sir? You have no clearance. How, how do you- how do I know I can trust you? Well, let me tell you, with a series of burps, farts, and other funny, scratchy sounds. Because I'll give you my sister's phone number and I'm definitely not a Lombax. Oh, why didn't you say so? Dude, what if your- dude, what if your sister just wants phone number? Didn't she tell you she didn't fucking want it? <laughs> well, what took you so long? Clank, uh, what are you doing here? You're supposed to meet me on the surface. I thought I would help. Well, you can give me a hand searching Dr. Nefarious' office. What's he doing? Uh, well, let's see. Uh, oh, look at this. The complete Secret Agent Clank Holovid collection. <laughs> this guy's your biggest fan. That is rather disturbing. I have downloaded an encrypted star map. Perhaps Al can decode it. Great. Let's get back to the Phoenix. Nice. I hate computers. I hate computers. Get out of here. Yeah? There we go. <laughs> Very good loading screen. That's extremely good. Whoa, whoa, down we go. Yahoo! This is quick. Oh, this is kind of automatic. Kind of. There we go. All right. Hey! Whoa! Deja vu. Oh, oh it's you two again. Right on schedule. This here is one of the nastiest, <laughs> right smelliest sewers in the galaxy. Most guys wouldn't set foot in a place like this, but me? Ah, I just can't get enough. Weird. Right. Well, we were just passing through. You can get back to whatever you were doing. Hey, if you find any sewer crystals, I'll pay you for them in bolts. I'm making something special for the missus. Sewer crystals. Uh-huh. We'll keep that in mind. Sell two sewer crystals for four thousand volts. Oh man, I wanna, I wanna do it, but I really gotta, I gotta, uh, hey, this level closed out so I can get the stream closed out. Where am I? Where am I going next? Turn of the Phoenix. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're, we're, oh, interesting. So this, this is a whole, a whole area. All right, I'll do this later. Let's go. It is a little yucky. Speaking of poop necklace for someone. I mean, hey, you know what? No, no judgment. So just like in Going Commando, here's our massive farming level. Yeah, there's a... Bound to be it. Few of those. They were they were really cool in Going Commando, so I, I'm not surprised they brought them back. I like that. It helps for sure. Also, it's a very good way to get bolts. <laughs> Sorry to disturb your work, sir, but you may want to. Does the various like secret agent clank? Jason Aquatos has been penetrated. Impossible. <laughs> if you say so, sir. They apparently stole some sort of data disk. Well, I must be off now. Dirty laundry and whatnot. Is responsible for this outrage. I believe it was a Captain Quark or something. Quark. Oh yeah, I guess that was his. You will always be the love of my life. <laughs> oh, it's this bit. Oh wow. You really should have that looked at. I remember this bit from the Kraken Time opening. That moron could never hope to match wits with the likes of me. That's if fucking great. If anyone can beat a moron at his own game, it's you, sir. 
He has, however, assembled a group of elite agents known as the Q Force. What? This Q Force must be stopped. Destroy them, eradicate them, annihilate them all. <laughs> it's on my to-do list. Right after folding your wow. undergarments. Yeah, I can see why they kept them around. This is this is an incredibly good villain to introduce after the last two games. Like, holy shit. The 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 way that they upped the ante of like character work in this game is so good. Well, team, I believe some congratulations are in order. <laughs> after all, my plan worked even more perfectly than expected. Well? <laughs> uh, way to go, dude? Don't mention it. God. I'm just doing my job. Fuck off. Now that I know where the Tyranoids are coming from, I can put a stop to this alien menace once and for all. With utter disregard for my own safety, I've drawn up an ingenious plan for an attack on Tyrannosis. First, I shall humbly step aside. Ratchet Pug! Allowing Ratchet to free fall down and take out the mortar launchers at the landing site. Once the mortars have been silenced, the dropship will make its descent. Next, Ratchet will take the assault vehicle from the dropship, make his way to the four plasma cannon turrets, and destroy them. Once the turrets have been knocked out, Ratchet will personally lead the assault on the main enemy base. <laughs> Jesus right, Christ. Let's get to it. Yes, you there in the front. Uh, yeah, hi. I was just wondering, what are the rest of you going to be doing while I'm down there getting blasted? We'll be monitoring the situation closely from here. Actually, we'll be down at the lunch buffet on deck five. Dude, he wants to it's kill me so bad. Day, but we'll be rooting for you every step of the way. Yeah, man, we got your back. Yeah, the plan is excellent. <laughs> Dude, I, I'm gonna die. I mean, they want him, he wants me to fucking die. Captain Thatcher. Yes? Are we there yet? Negative. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm gonna call it here for tonight. Oh, what a, what a good game. This, this, this is what I was looking for. This is, ex this is exactly as good as I was hoping it would be so far. This is what I fucking wanted. Um, they really, really did a good job fixing up the pacing and the, and like the character work and the, and the story focus on this game. Um, I am so much more, I'm already like so much more invested in what's going on. I like know what I'm fucking like fighting against. I know what I'm doing. I'm not just like doing odd jobs. Um, all the characters are like as good as ever. Uh, I love the shit with, with that's going on with Clank right now. He's, he's, he's doing some fun character stuff. He's finally getting some appreciation. I feel like there might be an arc with him maybe regarding that. Um, at least they're setting up for something like that, if nothing else. Like, it's... This is so... So good. This is so good. And then, of course, you know, uh, it, it once again just completely... Completely uh, continues to improve and refine the gameplay... Um, I really like a lot of the the quality of life improvements they're they're still making, and with each game it gets it gets better and better in that regard. Uh, yeah, so this is is such a strong start. I'm so excited. I I can't wait to come back and play more. Um, I likely won't come back to this until next week though. Um, it's a because uh, I got like I gotta get back to it takes two later this week, and also I was I was probably gonna start my um my prey randomizer run tomorrow. So uh, we won't be coming back to this until next Tuesday, most likely. Um, if I have the energy and I just like, I, I just like can't wait, I could do it on Sunday night, but given how packed this week is probably gonna be, I'm, I'm, I should take that day to rest uh, and take care of some stuff uh, in, my, in my living space. So, um, you know, if not that, then Tuesday it is uh, and uh, I'm, I can't wait. I'm so excited. I hope you are as well. I'm going to get going uh, and uh, get some rest. 
I encourage everybody to do the same. Take care. I hope y'all had a great time. Uh, as always, uh, please be good to yourselves. Please be good to others as well. Do something nice for yourself if you haven't in a while. If this is your first stream, I hope you had a great time. I hope you will consider coming back in the future. Uh, make sure to follow the channel and uh, turn on stream notifications once you do so that you know when these things are happening uh, or at least make sure that they are turned on. I think they turn on automatically, at least on mobile. Uh, but yeah, uh, that's a really good way to know that these are happening. Um, if you are subscribed to the channel or if you uh, plan to subscribe and you would like to join the sub Discord server, that is also a really good way to get notified of these streams uh, because I ping the chat every single time I go live. So if you're in there, you're going to know when these are happening pretty easily. Um, and uh, yeah, have a wonderful day or a night, whatever it is where you are. I'm going to get some rest. Uh, tune in next Tuesday, most likely, for uh, for more Ratchet and Link up your arsenal. And uh, tune in tomorrow and uh, maybe one more time the rest of this week for some other fun stuff that I'm, I'm pretty excited about. So, all right. Good night, everybody. Bye.